Come back from the club, right? Jump in the shower. You go first. Get her phone. Well, if you uh. want. Get her phone. <laughs> Jump in the shower, right? right? Hand her business. Then she go in the shower. You set up the acoustics or the sound in the room. Now, I don't know if you're a six minute, eight minute, 12 minute, four minute, three minute kind of guy. Some of them look like ones. You make shit. I've been one, I've been one, one time. <laughs> no, no. Man, unexpected sex get, get, will make you come fast. The main shit. Comes. <laughs> no, no. Unexpected sex start? make you come like shit. It's like, yo, what? Where did this come from? Come. <laughs> <laughs> they all laugh because they agree. <laughs> all of the guys in the room has had that well, happen. You know, What's up, what's up, it's Lip Service, I'm Angela Yee. I'm Gigi McGuire. I'm L'Oreal. And we have a virgin, and when I say virgin, <laughs> I mean a lip service virgin here with us. Wale! Woo! Woo! So you know what that means, he has an EP out right now. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just here for promotional reasons. And we're just gonna talk about music, that's it. Yeah, yeah right. right. Wow. <laughs> Wow. Now, you can't talk about me because Wale, I think, is so diverse with his music. You can tell that he's a, a lover type of guy, which is the kind of music that we like. But then we also like the lyrical music. Well, I got a great imagination. Oh, so I you've mean, never been in love? Yeah, I, I think everybody has some time, right? Why are you mumbling? Come here. Uh, well, yeah, come like, here. Why are you acting all nervous? <laughs> acting. I'm not, what were we? What was, <laughs> wait, the, question? Wait, wait, what was wait. the question? <laughs> I've been in love before. I've been, I've been in love before, yes. Okay. Yeah. And so what makes somebody fall out of love? Um, I think sometimes people just grow apart. Yeah, that that was that was trying to say that in a shorter way. Uh -huh. I know you mean just grow apart. How can you say it's shorter than that? It's <laughs> just a one, in one word. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah. I, I think yeah, you grow apart, and and, and those are those are kind of like the most painful ones though, because it's like you really can't pinpoint what it is. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It's just like this person. And, it, and and sometimes people think it's because of somebody else. It's just like this part. Man, you're just not like the same. Like your views on the world might just might change, or your views on or the things that you thought were important to to you aren't the same no more. And it's just like y'all not even arguing, but y'all just not the same. And you know, to be with somebody, to be in love with somebody, you gotta really be their friend and be like have things in common, even if it's the opposite attract thing. You still have to have this some type of like vibe with each other. And sometimes people vibe change. And then they they don't align with each other. That's true. But sometimes it is another person. <laughs> <laughs> that too. Sometimes mm -hmm. it's another person. Somebody might come along and you think that what you got going on is great and this person might just show you something a whole nother world. But I think when you when you when you when you say I love you, I think you know all sides of that person by that point. You can't love somebody unless you know all sides of them and what they're capable of. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's true, you but like, know, like, like you, you, you said, love, like love, not love. not fall out of right, like right, or lust right. with. So right. And sometimes I think, and this goes for men and for women. Whoever you wish should help you step your game up, because sometimes you showing somebody so much, and you're like, okay, what about me? Show me something. Reciprocity, now. man. Mm -hmm. yeah. What I get back? What can I get back? Like, and you know, like the older I get, the more like you know, you go through this phase, and you go through, you know, dating or whatever. Like me, it's like I'm almost like. I, I can't, I can't do this no more. Like I don't even know. And then, um, even when I was talking to Jada, I, I was like, okay, y'all, how, 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 where am I supposed to meet? If I'm really trying to, like, I'm on some serious shit now. You like, talking about Jada Pinkett Smith, by the way. Okay. Where, why, where would, where would I meet said woman? Where, like, where's she gonna be at? Mm. I mean, my, I, I, all I do is work. I go to the studio. You know what I'm saying? I, 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 I might host a club that night or. Where, and, and when I'm out of the studio, it is nighttime. It's not like nowhere to go. Like it's only one place that I'm really that are actually women at. You know what I'm saying? Where is that? The strip club. It, the strip club, or like, even, or, or the in, or the industry where it's like it, it's, it's 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 really difficult. Well, to, you do to, online to find dating. Uh, when when I get like screenshot or something. Well, not, like, why don't you go grocery shopping at Whole Foods? I, I went grocery shopping and, I, and it took <laughs> just me, went it or took in the four, gym. It took me four hours to just get like like eight eight items, man. Yeah, why? but you're supposed to be looking at the women that's there shopping. Oh, because people Whole wanted Foods. to take pictures where, where, and where, where, where I'm gonna go? <laughs> talk to you. Exactly. Uh, where I'm gonna go? Where, I mean, everybody, every like you famous is like you know you already gotta like you already like worrying about somebody's intentions. Right. You know right. what I'm saying? You worried about like who like. My thing is, you can have whatever, like you could have been through whoever. But like when it's somebody, when it's industry people, and it's like it might be like, oh man, well she's to date like one of the producers I work uh -huh. with, or 
you know, one of the directors I'm cool with or whatever. Like, so you, you kind of just so fall back. Right right. So it's, listen, you know, that's interesting. You, just, you don't start, you don't pursue something that you know what it is. Like, I'm like, all if right. If you this, already started dating, yeah, and then found like, because there's been girls that like, you know, I felt like I felt chemistry with, but I'm like, you know, what I'm saying, you dealt with that person, man. Mm-hmm. Like, I'm not even gonna like, I'm not even gonna acknowledge it. Like, I'm gonna just this. Let it go. Yeah, don't. That's interesting because yeah. Meek posted that he said you can't cuff a John when your close homies dunked already. That's a rule, dog. Yeah, I mean. I don't like to make anything absolute because right, because if there is if there if love is love and what we say it is then it could conquer all of that but you know you my thing is my thing it might like I, I might not not you know I would have to get to know them and spend time with them to fall in love I wouldn't allow myself if I even see that some type of chemistry potential you gotta just cut it off yeah this yeah. woman that has a baby by two of the Jacksons and their brothers right so I feel like if she can accomplish that. Some of these hoes, <laughs> that's fucking two or more friends. I feel like they could accomplish. If you could fuck you know, brothers. If you could fuck brothers. Come on. And she got kids by both of them niggas. Everybody, everybody don't, because I think about the repercussions nasty, of that. By the way. You know what I'm saying? Right. And even me, I've been cousins. single I've been single for so long, but I I, I just always felt like, okay, my, my daughter's mother, I respect her, and she's such a great mom. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I I'm... It's hard to be a dad on the road. She's a great mom, mm-hmm. but I never like wanted to be seen out with a girl or rub it in her face or whatever. Like, so you care about her feelings? I so care you don't about. Wanna... I mean, even right now, I'm just oof, like, like, yeah, but I don't. I at the very at the very least, she deserves that much, or she deserves that much for me not to be like flaunting it around. Flaunting well, why didn't things work out with her then? It, it, Grow people grow apart. You know what I'm saying? We, people grow apart, and you know, I'm I know how I'm wired now. You know what I'm saying? I t- head to toe, and I know how she wired. And it's like, in order for us to to obtain happiness in our lives, we can't, we can't. This can't be. This cannot be because we we don't. I'm not trying to trap you in a situation where you're with somebody that you're you're not living your best life. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Like I'm not trying to trap you in there. But, or because or because because we feel like we have to because we we made life together like nobody should do that that's detrimental to everybody because now you're gonna now that kid might grow up in a house where the parents are fighting all the time because mm-hmm. they really don't want to like you might as well just say like we grown apart. I see and a lot of people force it. it. Like yeah, I see a lot it. of people are like, well, for the sake of my child, like I'm just gonna stay with this person. And then guess what? It's it's, it's false hope because right. it's, there's gonna come a time when, we, when lawyers get involved. There's no ma- some kind of way it's gonna you're not it's not gonna it's, there's there's an expiration date on my that. parents divorced right when I went to college for real yeah they was like <laughs> I think Bye. they was waiting they was like Nigerian. your brother's in college you're in college all right Nigerian oh I, I get, guess get, get, get home. Home. oh yeah yeah that's nice yeah. kind of like like <laughs> like like not non chivalrous. don't worry about it I got you just let me know <laughs> I don't know if it's emasculating yet but <laughs> borderline emasculating <laughs> All right, so um, we're gonna get into it since we have Wale here. Which, by the way, I, I didn't think we was into. It. I didn't think he was gonna no, really we come. We wasn't into it yet. Yeah, not yeah. yet. That was the tip of the iceberg. Cheers. <laughs> now we <laughs> want to ask you. We ain't getting nothing yet. <laughs> Listen, when he came my, in, my, my little sister said she said so. Hey. Oh. That's your little sister, yeah, for real. Oh, oh. oh. Was, <laughs> we raised her. We raised her. We, <laughs> we came up in the same. Grew up in the same house. Okay. I was about to say we're yeah. gonna need you to step outside while we finish yeah. these questions. Nasty things. <laughs> not, oh shit. Now we were. Well, um, somebody had asked a question right on social media to us. Yeah. About erections. Okay. So oh, yeah. Basically, yeah. So the question is... Just leave the room real quick. <laughs> yeah, see, that's what I was saying. I'm yeah, not sure. Is this okay? It, 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 no, this is, this is actually funny. She's grown for 21, right? She's grown. Yeah. She grown. Yeah, she good. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So I know a girl that reached out to me, uh-huh. and she basically said she went out on a date. She's grown. About, you know, early 30s, late 20s. And um, she went out on a date with this guy. They were dancing. And out of nowhere, she felt an erection. A little poke coming A little through. poke, you know. Yeah. With, uh, you know the song, Too uh-huh. Close. Mm-hmm. So... I guess it was a little weird for her, like a little awkward because she didn't know how to confront it. She that felt like be, she should be. I mean, she should. She should be flattered. She should, flattered. That, it's not. You can't control that. You that's know what, what I was saying. It's not okay. like you said. It's okay. not like you said. God damn, baby, my shit hard. Shit, like 
He's like, oh shit, like I'm enjoying this a little bit. So he He's didn't like, say anything. Sometimes, right? <laughs> sometimes it's good. Nor did he try to, to sometimes it's good to, if you're getting close. This sounds good to have. You know what I'm but here's make the sure problem. your jump warmed up a little bit. If that, if that's the vibe between you and right, Shorty, right? So you know what I'm saying. Like clearly she, they're dancing, she, she, so she's she, attracted to him. She that's like, what I was thinking she's as like, well. Okay, yeah, but here's where the problem like, she gets knew a little. What's on, now you know what's on the menu. <laughs> right. Yeah. Okay. That's true. It'd be where Now you know where this could go, but even it could be more beautiful. Right. But unfortunately, you know, nothing was said, nothing happened, and he just said, "All right, bye, have a good day." And that night. Was the end of the and date. He came end already. of the date. Uh, nah. You think on. he came? Yes. Nah, ain't no, niggas, he ain't niggas ain't. Come on. Bro. Yes, they can. I'm just saying. It wasn't a lap dance, Angela. Uh, don't, don't, don't. It wasn't hunting. Gigi, guys well, it have was come. A party. Hold on. Can guys come from you just grinding on yes, them? Yes, like, absolutely. All I've the had time. It he probably nutted and was like, all right, nah, have a good night. I don't think, I don't think, I, see, I don't know, but I, I think you got to be a, you got to be a different type of nigga to come while you dancing on somebody. Uh, if you have a good imagination. Man, no, this, this music's so loud. There's so, many, there's so much going on. What the hell? No. Just dancing. <laughs> Maybe he so, didn't have that much sex before in life. Right. That's why he I, got excited. I've never really had sex, so. Shut up. Wait, what? He don't talk about his daughter. So, yeah. we'll leave, so it leads to the question of, the story leads to the question uh, of. So basically, have you ever been in a situation where, you know, your thing got hard? You got an RE, random erections. <laughs> random erection like where you couldn't control it. Like, no, as a grown adult. Yeah, as a grown adult. No. You don't get random erections still? I thought every guy Oh, randoms, had. yeah. Random, yeah, random erections. Yeah, like, yeah, like, yeah, like, like, like like, yeah, y'all like nipples, y'all nipples get hard, and don't mean you horny. Well, it's though. cold when that happens. But you got your nipples, nipples get hard get too. Hard. No, I, I think it's a. It's do a, do it's your just, nipples get hard every time you get an erection? I don't know. I don't feel my nipples. <laughs> you can't tell. I, I feel like I that when guys my, get. I don't, I don't think. I don't. When feel guys get an erection, their nipples get hard. I don't. I, don't I think it's natural. I don't know. It goes together. This is weird. I don't know. I don't feel weird. This is weird. This is weird. Yeah, I don't know. Well, every time your nipples are hard doesn't mean a man's dick is hard. It could be cold out. Yeah. But getting them jumps while you dancing, I don't I don't know about that life. Like, I think that's why it'd she be was good though. For that really. seems like fun. It would be fun sometimes. <laughs> if like, guess what? <laughs> <laughs> I know you feel that. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Look what you didn't did. Look what you didn't started. You thought, you thought it was a party, but it's a party party. <laughs> <laughs> it started, started. And she's supposed to be like, is that a gun in your pocket? Yeah, or are you not, just happy to see I'm me? I'm very happy to see you. <laughs> bang, ba- bang, bang, bang. Pinky in your pocket. <laughs> <laughs> might have been small. <laughs> <laughs> might have been small. Can you remember any times you got a random? Erection that was a terrible time for it to happen. <sighs> that you were like, "Fuck, I got on these sweatpants." <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I can't. <laughs> I might just. Have, I probably just. I probably would just. Just you know, what I'm saying? just you know, because I'm not. It's not like I'm aroused. It's just. Right. It's just it just like, happens. Just right. My body just. Just. Erect. You know, doing his own thing right now. How do you get it down? I mean, I just just you probably just got waited out. Head. Wait it out. Uh, he gets head. Uh, I wish. If I get on, if I had on speed dial, whew, life would be different. You definitely have head on speed dial somewhere in that phone. Stop um, it. No, nah, I got headaches on speed dial. Mm. <laughs> okay. All right, now we're going to uh, play a little game. Mm. It's called Is It Cheating? And you guys are going to weigh in and say it's in these different scenarios. All That's what cheating. I said. That's not true. <laughs> all of you don't even cheating. know what the questions you gotta are. You got to ask, it's cheating already. Yeah. Is it cheating? Yes. If you <laughs> flirt and go to lunch with a coworker, is that cheating? You motherfucking right. Cheating? You're flirting and enjoying isolated company. But you're at with work. A, with another person. What if y'all split the bill? You ain't in prison. The what fuck? if they yeah, split the bill? Yeah, you work. Yeah, what if you go Dutch? What's Dutch? They're splitting the bill. It don't, bro. It's about the time spent. It ain't about the money. <laughs> it's about the time. It's an isolated environment with somebody with another dude, and you said flirting. Yeah, just flirting. You already not. Nah, oh shit, man. You I feel sorry for you, man. You don't think people flirt when they're in relationships? What? I don't. I don't. It's a human thing. Yeah. Yeah. Well, flirt. I, well, well. I don't. I don't. I think the last time I really had a girlfriend, I was in a different mental space about life. Like I, I kind of believed that, you know, shit could be perfect. Mm-hmm. Um, so I don't know. Uh, Maybe, well... So that is cheating. Yeah, it was definitely cheating. I have a question. But about flirting with... I don't know, because... Does the significant other know that you're going to lunch with your co-worker? Yeah, you could be like, I went to lunch with you're so-and-so different. today. So, you know how people be having work husbands and work wives? Like, that's my work husband. But you know what? I'm... I'm, I'm, I'm he better I'm, be gay. I'm, I'm not... I'm, I'm kind of like a... Uh, like... What's the word I'm looking for? Uh, contradicting myself, because... Mm-hmm. Like at this point in my life, 
I would I would date a stripper. Like I'll date a stripper and like that's my girlfriend. But she, at work she's, she's definitely flirting. But she's definitely flirting. Right. That's but, your job. But guess what though? I guess I'm just I guess maybe flirting is within. It's like it's an act. It's an act that it may be nerve. Ner I'm nervous, but I, I this guy's he's he's not he's not ugly. He's funny, but but it's also a nerve thing because you a lot of girls flirt when they're nervous. You know what I'm saying? But if you actually like low key like feeling this nigga like. And in, in, in your mind, he's a he's he's playing like second string, like just in case your man <laughs> act up. That's cheating. And yeah, it's yeah. definitely it's on, no, that's super cheating. Intentions the regular one is regular cheat. cheating. This one is super cheating. And <laughs> if, super cheating. if 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 the flirting is multiple times a day, you're super saying cheating. Lupa, Vegeta, Goku levels of cheating. <laughs> flirting makes me uncomfortable if I don't like the person. What about when people think you're flirting and you're not? No, I don't like that either. Uh, I yeah. be joking like, with people yeah, she was flirting lying. with me. And you flirting like, just because flirting? I'm nice to you does I, not mean I'm flirting. I, mean, I think our, our, as you get older, flirting comes within. Like you, 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 you like some girls are just charismatic. Right. If you charismatic, you charismatic around women or men. Right. You just a charming motherfucker, like, and niggas gonna laugh, like, or some women um, speak more like. Yeah, they like, touchy. touchy they, they're just not yeah. like that. Might be the way they. they might be the way they raise. They might be whatever. Like, yeah, that's some why, people are more like they put their hand on your leg when they talk to you. But what touch if they're your arm? That's why I never do that. That's why I never time. react in this industry. I, right. I never think. I always think, like, like I was with. A uh, female artist and a male artist the other day, and and she's like, no, you can't tell she trying to let you. I'm like, bro, you don't want to assume, especially like, you, especially in this hypersensitive age and shit like that. You don't want to assume, bro, like because you assume and you take too much lead, it's gonna be like, uh, my nigga, I was just being nice to you and shit like that. Well, bro. was it Issa, right? Because I seen her twerking no, 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 on no, you no, no, on, no, no, no. A, on no, the vlog. No, Issa, Issa, we good friends. <laughs> we just good friends. Oh, okay, okay. Charlie, I, no, I'm, I, I see a lot of inspiration in her, though. Like, <laughs> I, I'm very inspired by what she does. Like, we talk a lot, like, during, like, the season when she's making the show, and I get a lot of that energy that she give me. Whether it's what's going, she could be mad on the set that day or whatever. I get like a lot of energy because she's thriving. She's trying to go up. She working. She hustles. She was. She, I'm literally seeing her evolve into something greater. And you know, it's, it's. I'm so proud of her for that. I take that energy and I write like. She's definitely my muse sometimes, she's though. Dope. I wish I she's was friends with Issa Rae. She's definitely mm -hmm. my. She's right, definitely she's my. And Ivan yeah, Orji, you know I love Ivan. Both Orgy. of them is that. Both of them are, are my muses a lot, and like I could. There's probably like 40 songs that y'all nobody will ever hear that are in the, along the lines of like Bad and Lotus and stuff like that. Like, and I've used. I definitely use Issa as my muse That's a lot. Dope. Why would we never? What's what happens when we never hear them? I mean, they you just... don't. I can't. I can't. If, if I if you got too many options, you got none. So I can't just brought, drop a whole lot of music. I got to spread it out evenly. We love when Wale talks to the ladies on his record. Mm -hmm. What's because y'all ladies? <laughs> no, talking to us. I, mm -hmm. no, because a lot of you know artists try to talk to the ladies and they don't really connect. Yo, I this is for like the ladies. Hold yeah. up, my four or five talked in the. <laughs> I fuck yeah. hoes every day. My four like, five talk <laughs> with my heart used to be. Uh, and then we got to put it on. You're like, what the it. fuck? Like, I don't I like this shit. The ladies, you're such a fucking hoe. <laughs> I love uh, it. Well, <laughs> let me just tell y'all something right now. If that song came out four months ago, it'd probably be one of the biggest songs of the summer, whether y'all like it or not. I'm just letting <laughs> no, you know. The song like is a good song, but we just saying that's not to it, the ladies. It, it, that's it, just it, a hundred percent like is for the ladies. Like me knowing Kanye, how I know him, he was like, they going to stay. The girl's going to sing this louder than the niggas. Yes, and it, yeah. and it will be. Yeah, you're gonna yeah. you're gonna hear the high pitched voice in the club over the male voice. <laughs> like yo, such a fucking. It's gonna sound like a unison of women that want to get ratchet. Because All right. the, the the new the new the new like the mo new to, in my opinion. Mm -hmm. Let me just just All right, let's hear the this. modern new woman is highly educated and highly ratchet. Mm -hmm. Sophista ratchet. Mm -hmm. it, it, that's it. It's, she's an educated, not meaning book smart, but like just like well, well read, like you know, uh, 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 street smarts. But ratchet, know what meaning? And I, I'm using ratchet in a cartoonistic way. Like ratchet in a way is like um, I want to go turn. I want to go turn up to city girls. Mm -hmm. Like she, like you get in her car and it's just all city girls in 90, 90s R and B. Right. That's it. And then she get out. And, and she get her. out. She know all the words. She can rap. But she goes it, to her business that she started. Right. Yeah, mm -hmm. and she goes to her business that she started, and she sells bundles and make drug dealer money. <laughs> like you know what I'm saying? Like that's 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 almost like the modern girl, like the modern you know 2019 you know girl on the come up. Okay, now is this cheating? Getting a lap dance in the strip club? No. I knew Gigi was going to say that. Gigi's gonna say that. Like, no, you answered the strip club. 
that's on the menu. That's already on the menu. Like it's like, yeah. I mean, if you vegan, are you going to McDonald's? Like you know what I'm saying? Like they have vegan options. It's McDonald's. Salad. It's still it's McDonald's. Let me get a quarter pound of no meat. Fried. A lot of vegans are vegans for health purposes. It's McDonald's. <laughs> so why <Wale, laughs> McDonald's? When you're nigga. in a relationship, you'll get lap dances and everything. I'm just asking. I would. I would. I would. And I mean, in a perfect world, but we don't live in one. But I would like. I would go get them with my girl. We're mm-hmm. going out. We go out together. Oh. A couple that lap dances together. She's picking her nose. Zoom She's in. She's trying to move from the camera. Uh, Zoom in. Zoom in. Don't get me on camera. What's up? You good? Get that boogie. Yeah, yeah, yeah watch out. Say? Now you got a booger in your hair. You no, 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 no. The raw okay. honesty on the show is too. Boogie, boogie, boogie. But yeah, you going to not lap dances, ain't no, because... I mean, like, I, obviously, I'm on the road. I might, I, I host a strip club from time to time. D, mm-hmm. uh, DJ Self hit me. I want to host one of these New York Jones. I, I got some new Jones oh, in there. Oh, we got you. I got, yeah. some new, I got some new Jones in there. I want. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Um, <laughs> See, that's why he don't have no girlfriend. No, I like. I mean, I, <laughs> I like. I like strip club. I just said I date a strip. I ain't gonna meet her at work though. Mm-hmm. I ain't gonna meet her at work most likely. It'd His be DMs like, about I, to be crazy. I, I, All the strippers gonna be on like, DMs. <laughs> well, nah, I ain't. No, I don't want it. I don't want no smoke. L'Oreal, is that cheating? If your man got a, la- a lap dance, would you feel away? So, first of all, you're don't... with him. You're going with him. Yeah, I got to go with him, but, like, don't Let's go to the strip club without me. I think <laughs> a lot of girls get turned on by not their... Ma- by their... <laughs> I, I think a lot of girls get turned on by looking at their man getting uh, no. a, a, a joint. No, I didn't say, every, I didn't say all of them. Oh. I bet, like... <laughs> Like some of my best female friends are strippers, bro, mm-hmm. and I and I know what I know what it's like. Or I like go to a strip club or whatever, and like I might get a lap dance or whatever. But it, like we we might even just talk a little bit while she dance, and then I'll be like, man, you know what? Let's just, did we talk? But, now Gigi got to weigh in on this because mm-hmm. Gigi. Well, let it, us as women know yeah, why. Gigi, why. Why does she have a way? Well, because she was a stripper, she so she knows what it's like. So she there can... was a girl named Gigi I mentioned in the song one time. What? Yeah. Yeah. Are you hurt? I think I am. <laughs> <laughs> was it? You know, oh, everybody thought we were having sex because you said my name in the song. But we're going to talk about that later. How is this? Answer, answer, answer the question. She's, she's, Gigi, she's, she's, how is this? She's the that? Michael Jordan no, of pole dancing. I'm joking. I'm joking. Listen, <laughs> I, I, don't you think you, I think you're the Michael Jordan of pole dancing. Absolutely. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, for sure. Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> but it's, it, wasn't a, it wasn't really a thing. Like, it was Before. Like, or like an so. athletic like a like a sport like an Olympic sport. Right. Like, it's it's Michael Phelps. Sport. Uh, yo, mm-hmm. yo, another idea we got like yo, Olympic people. Hey, pole dancing. Pole dancing. <laughs> it takes a lot of strength. No, yeah. it is a sport, isn't it? It's, it's a, a sport in other countries, but it pole dancing is a sport. Yeah, it's a sport it in other countries, yeah, but it hasn't made it to the United. In the United States, it's still taboo. Well, about the mood. No, there. listen, Germany. No, because you laughing like uh, am I listen. Laughing? <laughs> Why y'all laughing? No, Australia, Germany. Nah, you was mad Germany, hype when you found out that it was a sport. Countries <laughs> and people. Sport. No, I mean, pole dancing people. is a sport. I'm just... Internationally, yes. But countries. Germany, <laughs> Australia, there's a lot of companies where pole dancing is a sport. I'm sure they're going to raise money for Gigi to go I'm compete. Sure, I'm, sure, <laughs> I'm sure they're, they're, they're fully clothed and down. stuff. Like, it's different. Yeah, like, like how it is when we teach class. It's not, yeah, yeah. It's not like naked. I'm not going to lie. We went to go see Cirque du Soleil and Michael Jackson went, and I was like, Gigi That's one of my favorite pole dancers. Felix Kane. Yeah, She has that You killed that in the show. Yeah, I saw it when they came to Atlanta. But anyway, go ahead. We got to do like a pole dancing musical. <laughs> like, that'd be fire though. Hey, that'd be fire. Can you Jordan. make this happen? We should do that. I know a lot of I know a lot of white people. I feel like you giving shit away. We'll talk about this later. All right, now we're going to date this motherfucker. Because I can, I can no, help write, me and Jeezy can write it. My, my little, she's going to write, she's going to write, hey, she's going to yeah, get, get in the music. car, she's going to be like, my nigga, that bold ass and I did it. Nigga, I no, already no. sent the email away. You know how many people, it's like a burlesque show slash yeah. play. Yeah, with yes. be fire. 500 people, nothing, Old nothing dance choreography big. is real. That's All right, tight. so go ahead, Gigi. So why That's should we tight. not, as women, be worried when our man goes and gets a lap dance at the strip club? Well, for starters, in the era that we're in right now, the type of dancing that goes on in a strip club, in the mainstream strip club, in your Onyx, in your Magic City, in your V Lives, it's, it's not like they're on a couch getting grinded on and like all mm-hmm. up close and personal. Mm-hmm. Most of those clubs, unless it's a private VIP. When you're a handsome rapper, most of those clubs, they're just dance, standing in front of you dancing. You know, mm-hmm. like they just stand in front of you and dance. Now, that's when they're 100% nude. I'm talking about those Miami, Atlanta, so if they all Houston. On you, if they all now, on you, or does that mean they like you or they want some more money? 
They want money. money. Well. <laughs> How do you know if a stripper like you? That's the real question. I want to know. Oh. How do you know if a, a stripper, stripper like you in real life likes you in real life? If she spends time with you. If and, she don't go to she spend, if she yeah if she spends time with you and and is not like and she not like can you compensate me because I miss work like if she really trying to get because I miss work because a line. girl yeah how many times have you heard that one? Heard she said it. never I got a good conversation listen <laughs> there's been know. times an isolated, where an isolated situation. you get an invite to go to Vegas for the weekend and you're like okay well that means I'm gonna miss Friday night Saturday night and that's about mm, twenty five hundred. Can you replace that for me missing work to spend this time? Oh no, nah, we ain't leave. Like I mean, if le leaving the strip club and and and, and she got to take know, off to come spend not, the weekend. It ain't. It ain't. It ain't. It, that's a mutual decision. I've decided I'll allow you around me, and you've decided you want to come around me. There's no. There's no payment. There's no nothing. I'm saying like, girls ask for that. No, nah, I understand that. So she's saying that. that's how so you know she's, a girl likes so you. If a she's not trying that. to come after your pockets, and she really want to spend time with you and get to know you, despite the fact that it's costing her money. Well, yeah, then I mean that's I a mean, that's a sign me that yeah, she might really be into you. Time. It, might, it might cost me money. I could be doing. I could be doing a feature for somebody right now. So now mm -hmm. you know if Wale likes you, if he doesn't ask you for money. No, I'm just like well, the first thing is the 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 real name though. That's like the first joint. Yeah, the real name. Thing is, is but now they're starting to get real smart. They got like a, they got a stripper name. I've always had an alias. Name. A yeah, I've the, always, I've always a stripper had a name, real, fake, real name. fake name, and alias. Yep. Then they real name. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I feel like if you get real to real name stages yep. a little bit, that's true. You know, and yeah. some might be in it for the long haul. Like I ain't gonna ask this nigga this time because in a couple months he just gonna be giving it to me. That yeah. don't happen to you. Nah, I don't, but I, is that one thing I can say of myself, of myself, I never like tricked off on like no stripper to like kick it or like be around or whatever. Like my thing is like, yo, like you know, I ain't no weirdo. Like you want to just do something tomorrow? Or whatever? <laughs> like, you also have the girls that feel like he bust so much, not come. He bust so many bands on me in the club that. Let me, it. Yeah, it's worth it for me to hang out well, with see, him. Because it's kind of like I a pre situation. That. I wouldn't even know. So. But because sometimes, like, you know, one thing is I don't even really enjoy lap dances that much because I'll be looking at all the other strippers, looking at the stripper that's Wishing dancing that for me. You. And, they, they and I'm like, yo, you know what? I don't want, even want no conflict. Like, right. Just let's get a little section and just Everybody all y'all just dance around. I'm going to throw money in the air. Yeah, look, that's the best way to do I'm it. I'm going to look cool and just, just throw it up. Another thing is, see, with you... Wale, it's a little different for you because you are who you are. You're not just average Joe coming in the strip club. I mean, you know, in a way, yeah. So no, it's a you're different. not. It's in a way, I mean, you're a rapper. I, they, they see yeah. niggas in you're they, see af, they see athletes and rappers all the time. True. And those who and and those on. people aren't <laughs> regular Joes either. Right. They also see Corey from up the street and goddamn got Ray Ray that worked for the for and Metro. They got, and they got you know what I'm saying, young, young, young. That, uh, yeah, then they that got the little rapper dope slim, boys slim trying and them to and them. They exactly. got it more money than a lot of the rappers. See, so you never slim really... Slimming them and them all of them. Slimming them and all of them. So slimming them really... and all of them got it. They, they getting all that real money. They getting that brown bag money you can throw whatever. They know them too, so... I look at strippers like you know rappers, athletes, all that. So like yeah. I, I, I consider those things. I never considered those things like six, seven years ago. I consider like that, like all right, what city am I, man? All right, you find like that. All right, so you probably know this person, that person, whether you tell me or not. I know such and such like bitches like you. Like I said, bitches, because my conscience talking to me. But <laughs> um, I'm just like you know, I, I, I process it like okay. I got these little philosophies, and mm -hmm. they, I ain't never. This is some exclusive shit. I ain't never broke this one down before. Like exclusive. I always, if I'm attracted to a woman, right, I, I consider all things before I even attempt to shoot a shot. In regular, like, like for instance, I saw three girls within the past like two years. I saw three girls working in high end clothing stores. Obviously, because I'm in the fashion, you know what I'm saying, and then it's a, it's an, it's like one of the rare environments I can actually meet a woman. I always consider the city we in, cause I'm like, okay, I know this person, this person, and this person, and this person shop here. in this city. Mm -hmm. I know they shop here. I know at least out of this, these seven, it might be Chicago. I'm like, I know this two niggas from the Bulls. I'm cool with. <laughs> I got a real close friend on the Bears. And I got three rapper friends I'm real tight with. You know somebody. Mm -hmm. Even if you tell me you don't, I know you know somebody. So my thing is, like, do I even want to jump out there? So 
like I'm thinking like, okay, well, is the vibe enough for her to give me give me her number? Or I'm like, oh, am I gonna just end up hearing, oh, she used to talk to such and such and such and such, and it make me impossible to make it impossible for me to go forward. But does the past really like matter? Yeah, <laughs> does the past really matter? No, it don't. But I'm just saying, if it's your, if it's people that it's you cool folks. with, because it's okay. like, what if it's somebody you cool with that y'all be, you know, y'all chill together, y'all bring, you know, I might be dating, I might bring a girl I'm dating, and then it, he yeah. with his new girl, and but it's like I'm bringing your old girl with me, and it's like, yeah. that's okay. weird. And 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 if I could stop that before I even happen, yeah. cool. But, it but does it like, make it um, awkward for you, like if somebody your friends would date somebody you used to date? How do you feel about that? And say you over Man, it. Man, this is Joan did. I used to fuck around with. We ain't date, but you know we, we we kicked it for a while. And like I, I know a couple of niggas that 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 you know. Had the back, it after had the, it. I, I know a couple of niggas <laughs> that had some background vocals. Oh. Added the background <laughs> vocals after I laid my verse. <laughs> <laughs> But does that okay. make you feel weird, like, or does like does it that. matter? I'm um, taking that. It worked. It worked. It worked. It 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 mattered at at some in some instances. I think it depends on the the the, the culprits. You know what I'm saying? Like, who is it? Like, if it's all right, I'm like, damn, nigga, I got like four songs with this nigga. Like, mm. uh, fuck, like, damn. You know what I'm saying? I, like, or, or like, dog, this is my man for real, like. The nigga wished me happy birthday. You know, <laughs> on Instagram, you know not like, on the stories. That nigga, that nigga posted my junk for his aesthetic, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? So it, it, it all really depends. Because at the end of the day, you have to come to a place in your heart where it's like, damn, okay, bro, like, GG, and G, like, you, we've we been in this game for a long time. Like, in real, in real world, like, if we was at a, one company, it's not that long. But in the industry, when we're in people face every day, we've been in the gym for a long time. So it's like a lot of times we end up, you know, dating people in our industry. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like we end up because it's like these are this is our world. We live in this weird devil's playground of like It's like a bubble. Yeah, it's a bubble. Mm -hmm. And it's like we don't really have an opportunity. Like every so often, like you might bump into somebody with a friend or you might have an industry friend with a friend or something like that. But we live in this small bubble that it's hard to find people that understand your lifestyle outside of it. You know what I'm saying? But while like, you said that wasn't your girl, you just, it wasn't even, you didn't even say dating. So, he fucked her, so. Right, No, so, we spent significant time together. But uh, it wasn't your girl, and you don't even consider it dating. I mean. So sometimes I, guys, sometimes, some, sometimes sometimes guys downplay. Like, sometimes I feel like, sometimes He's I feel greedy. like, it, sometimes I feel like you. Most men are. Some, no, no, seriously, sometimes I feel like this is a boyfriend-girlfriend situation, and then when it's over, like you reflect, like was it really like? Cause it's like mm -hmm. to be boyfriend girlfriend, like significant moments need to happen to me. Like it's just it's more of a, it's more, it's the title the uh, the younger you are, it's the feeling and the, the mutual respect. respect for each other the as you get man. older. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. I also feel like relationships need like a bottom line. Like if if you're really in a real relationship, then there's no question if you were after the fact if it was right. really real. Like you know, like, like that was my boyfriend, that was my girlfriend, that y'all were in a yeah. relationship. So it was, you know. For women sometimes we're like, well, he ain't never wife me. And so it yeah. is what it is. Exactly. But what if she says, you know, Solange is one of my favorite rappers and I know you fucked her. I mean rappers, is she a singers, rapper? <laughs> sorry. I was like, singers and I know you used to fuck with her, so I fell away about that. Would you well, like you like bitch, are you crazy? Well, you edited what you said. Though. What? <laughs> the first one was crazy. <laughs> rapper. What rapper? You know, no. Like, singer. Something or else. Fucked away. Sorry, Fox, fucked away, messed away. I don't even I don't I Because y'all was a couple, right? That publicly. That wasn't a that's that's not that's not I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Solange is one of my, my not name. like that, but Solange, I mean uh, fucked Solange, with like Solange master. A, I wasn't trying to be disrespectful. No, nah, no, you know, I, no, I know where I'm at. I know where I'm at. <laughs> like this ain't no, you know what I'm saying? I'm just trying to find a way to to to, to, to make it make sense. Um, Solange is a beautiful person inside and out. Like she's also been one of my muses. Like right. you know what I'm saying? Like you know, I ain't saying I'm Andy Warhol in my mind. I am, um, but you know, she's she's oh she's. She's like the 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 prototype of 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 like women I personally like, and you know me and her we were real cool like you know we used to, we used to, we used to we kick it like we like we was real cool mm -hmm. early on in my career. She taught me a lot about just music and just you know spontaneity and everything like that. But it ain't nothing like that. Mm -hmm. 
All right, now, is this cheating? Liking pictures of attractive people on social media. See, that, I, that's, that's, that's weird for me because, I, like, if, if, I, if I'm starting to like a girl in any kind of way, I won't follow her. I don't, I just try to not. But you'll look at her page, you just won't follow I'll her. I'll look at her page from time to right, time. But you won't follow her? And it was, <laughs> it, 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 it seemed like a guy like girls, but it's not really like that. <laughs> it was just one girl I was talking to, I, I was like, um, she was like, why you don't follow me on uh, um, nothing? I was like, because, you know, I could, like, the way Twitter set up, I mean, IG set up now, you can see the people that you follow, follow. Yeah. That, that comment. And, like, and, and it's comment. like right in your face. Like, I don't want to see that. And it's like, me, as a, as a, as like an overthinking, like neurotic, deep thinking, ratchet slash bad decision making <laughs> person. Like, I, I don't, I just don't even want that energy in the air because like, I get real sarcastic. Mm -hmm. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, Petty. I'm with, like passive aggressive, like, right. oh yeah. So you just going, um, <laughs> hey, how you know, um, such and such. You know, I, how you know this nigga? Hey, uh, I mean, right I, it, was, it was like multiple pictures. I'm just, I, you know, I, 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 you know, I don't know, I don't care. But it was like multiple. You like, liked like seven pictures back to back. It was like, see, I, I, I really don't know how to back figure to out. Back to back. I don't know how to figure <laughs> out the time. See, that's another thing. If I fi if I figured out a time, if it, was, if I, if, 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 that's bad for me. If I knew they were back to back to back to back, I'm like, come on, block. <laughs> but how you gonna you know see that? You would ask her to block. You can see no, I'm just saying, like, that's why I don't. That, like, I, like, it's just like, you know. It'll be like such and such, like. Eight it's just why because I feel like it sets you up nowadays. It's like, hey, look who commented underneath here. Man, yeah, Instagram, it's always Instagram work. working with the police, man. <laughs> it is. So is that cheating? If somebody say you're dating know. a girl and she's liking other guys' pictures, I don't think likes is cheating. I, I, I don't because I don't. That's, a, that's I don't know about that, but I mean, it's not cheating. I mean, you know what I'm saying okay. it might be a tad disrespectful, but again, it's with the it's the intent. What if she post a man crush Monday or somebody and somebody else? Yeah, that, that's not cheating, but that's just wild disrespectful. Yeah, that's disrespectful. That's like diet cheating. <laughs> it, it depends on what the it's person is, cheating. too. Like, if you're dating somebody that's like an athlete and you put a rapper, it's kind of like, damn, bitch, I know that nigga. Like, you can't do nothing like that. Right. But, but what if it's a regular I, I, I know, person? I take it for face value, though, because I'm, if I'm with you, I'm with you because I know what type of person you are. I know, I'm, but if she posted it like Denzel, you wouldn't she care. Know, I, I mean, no. Nah, and she's like I a was, college girl or something. You He's like older. Yeah, yeah, He's like, smooth, man. What the fuck you mean? <laughs> <laughs> He's going to move but, in. Be, I, don't, I don't know what your fetish is, Shorty, but like, you know what I'm saying? I don't. Mm -hmm. it's, it's the intent, though, for real. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like a girl might post a, like a dude that's like like a gay person, like a gay dude, like a model. You know what I'm saying? That everybody know is like you know don't even like women. I, it's like okay, I get it. Like that's the only it's some way. fashion shit right. or whatever. But like man crush, like I'm your man to mm -hmm. be crushed on every day. Mm -hmm. That's a fact. And nobody over me. Yeah, I'm, I feel like when you're that's not a, order. What if it's Barack Obama? She posts him as man crush. Man, he ain't the president no more. So, you know, <laughs> <laughs> nah, bro. But why Shardy, Donald Trump. Shardy find another word though. You, yeah. you know what? You know what? You know what the mm -hmm. connotation behind man crush is though. Right. Like there's a connotation behind it, and like that's like this is that's disrespectful. You even trying to get under my skin. Mm -hmm. Or like I yeah, wouldn't, that's true. I wouldn't do no woman crush. Like you know what I'm saying? I'm the same person that hasn't. But if you put Michelle I, Obama as your woman crush, because leave... she just did something phenomenal. No, just super no. woman. Super woman. Okay. That's right. what I posted. Yeah, it's other I'll words you other can words. use instead there's of man crush it, or woman yeah, crush. Man, woman crush and man crush can have a connotation behind them. Because mm -hmm. women post other women as their woman crush Wednesday sometimes. Well, well, they I, might be gay. Seventy percent of women would, would would do something with a woman. <laughs> Either receive or give or watch or something. Cause women do that for like our friends, like to shot your friend out. Like I used this to think all women friends fuck each other. That's what? Not that's true. not true. No one in this room has fucked each other. That's a fantasy. I yeah. No, no. I, that's why. That's why I grinned when I say it. I also <laughs> think that like any like well, I haven't seen one, but like if I ever see like a, like a, a hotel uh, cleaning service that. No, that's every man. That's women, just so you know. Like that's the every man. So like, the fuck the man. A hotel cleaner. That sounds like a weird. porno for real. <laughs> no, nah, that's er, how the every man. Every be. man. Like no bullshit. You like, want to fuck the lady that make your bed? It's, Hell yeah. It's, it, it, let me, it's not about what she do. It's about you know what I'm saying. The aesthetic. If you want to fuck her like, up against that cart she puts down It's not even about that. It's just you like yo. It's yeah. Security would have killed that bitch so fast. You know what it is? It's the unexpected joint. The unexpected pop off. Like yeah. Right. 20 seconds ago, I thought I'd be putting on my jeans. 
Mm-hmm. And now, you know I'm, now, I'm, now I'm, I'm trying to. I'm trying to put my jeans in you. <laughs> my jeans. <laughs> in you. I got it. That was that slick. was a bar. Yeah. <laughs> but then you gotta stop telling housekeeping come back. I'm sleep and no, go take a peek out the I door. I mean, no, it's, it's it's like something that that'll, that'll never happen. It's like fucking somebody in outer space. Right. Like most of the women. Um, they're cleaning the rooms in the hotel just don't fall within We might it. have to send somebody for your birthday no, somewhere uh-huh. where you at. That's jump like, out the no, cake. <laughs> jump out the cart. What this you doing know the cake? She got jump out the cart. This sounds illegal. <laughs> this this sounds mad illegal. illegal and in I have some, nothing to do with it. In some states. The comments are supposed to be easily and jumping down. You going to Vegas anytime soon? Vegas is fine, right? Vegas. We can send someone to your door. Man, Vegas and Miami are two cities that the first thing I think of in them cities is hangover. Yeah, that's right. It's just a hangover and Sure. Slam, you get a you get a you get a uh, offer to host a p- p- car in Miami. They be like, yeah, man, don't get here at like three thirty five. Like what? <laughs> what type of coffee do y'all have for me at the door? Like, <laughs> now, why am I up this late? The club closed everywhere yeah, else. Yeah, so you gotta yeah, be there. You gotta at that be time. there at three thirty five. Like, bro, <laughs> time I'm on London sleep, time, bro. It's like, time it's like yesterday. It's like next week right now to me. Now, I like that. Is this considered cheating? Somebody massaging your shoulders? Let's just say intent. Again, just and like, I hate oh, to keep harping on intent. Tense. I keep intent. That's and again, that's, that's that falls into the light cheating. <laughs> oh, these but, two girls are getting it on right here. You know, all friends fuck. That's, that's, <laughs> that was just, uh, you beat me to it. <laughs> the intent. Okay. The intent. Like, why are you? Why are you? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I never. I, I and I and I and I, I struggle with this too. Like, even if I'm like starting to fuck with somebody, like, but like. I don't Maybe never want to be that nigga that's like, why you, why you, why you doing this? Why you doing that? I just want you to either like be the type of woman that to tell me that, or just give me like that reassurance. You know what I'm saying? That, that like, you know what I'm saying? Like this shit ain't about that. Cause mm-hmm. I'm a man too. I got my pride. I ain't about to be like questioning what you doing with other niggas. But I'm at the point in my life right, right now where it's like, I don't ask any girl that I, I deal with that I, we haven't really been like official. I don't ask them who they with, why they with, or none of that shit. I don't give a. I don't. I don't I, like. I really don't give a fuck. I don't care. Do what you want to do. You know what I'm saying? But I'm like, but you don't expect like certain things because we're not, you know, we're not that. Mm-hmm. You know so if saying? a woman tries to ask you a question like, oh, well, I seen you on Instagram. Who don't was that girl? Bring that, don't bring that up. You'll be like, no. I mean, but a girl should be able to ask you anything if she she's wants. she's fucking like, you. Because I mean, sometimes yeah, she, things... she can, but I'm in the, I'm in the, in the entertainment business. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't It's don't, all entertainment, baby. I don't know. Like, I'm, I'm in working. the club. I'm in the club, but... What? You know, what the fuck? I ain't on Pornhub with no bitch. Like, what the, like, what's Cause that? if somebody is feeling a little insecure, shouldn't she she be able to say something like, you know? Give me an example. And I'll like give a picture. Okay, say a girl is like, uh, um, you know what? I just want to be honest with you. It bothered me when I saw you take a picture and post this picture. Say you posted a picture the other day with Taylor Works and said you was a fan or whatever. Right. What if she was like, well, that bothered me a little bit, and I Why? just want to be honest. Why? Cause the way your arm was around her. Is, is Arm, this my, whatever. That's my, so this familiar. Is this is somebody, somebody you're dating, fucking. Yeah. With. And you guys, because you should be able to have open dialogue. <laughs> I'm not having a good day. Stop, it's, it's, it's stop man. What? You should. That's what I say. Yeah, no, you tell her stop. Response, you tell me stop. Go ahead, go ahead, Charlie. Go ahead, Charlie. Like, go ahead, man. Fuck. And what if she's like, do you yeah, know that's her? Do you have her number? Like, yeah, I'll be like, I actually like Taylor, Taylor Rooks. I said Swift almost. You almost did too. Taylor Swift. Her too. I like both of them. Taylor Swift built like that motherfucking French fry. She's music, like the complexion music, of music, one too. Music is it's good for a demographic though, man. Like, it's good for a demographic. Swift, don't eat, just eat a celery stick a day. That's your vibe. But nah, no. Taylor Swift fans don't come at me. I was, that was like a black people joke. We make, y'all make them about us when we not around. All the time. I'm always gonna see a French fry when I see so you her. Tell her I'd... <laughs> Somebody gonna write a gift, right. a little dance with French fries. <laughs> and McDonald's fries, no. not a steak fry. Yeah, one. The, the, the thin joint. <laughs> Ain't even give it a potato Shoe wedge. String flow. So you would tell her no, no I actually like. Vibe. I actually like Taylor Rooks, you would say? No, I'm, nah, I was fucking with you, but... <laughs> no, like, That's saying, petty. Uh, I don't got... No, no, I mean, it depends what... If we at that level like that, like, it's, it's go ahead, like, stop it. You right. know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't... Come here, baby. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're like, you ain't you, got you, nothing you, to wear you, you want me to kiss you? Where? I can, I can see right. her doing right. something like that. And then that. she gonna point right at her crotch, right here. <laughs> right, right here. here. Right here. Yeah. And I'm like, yeah, what's okay, up? Are you done? You good? I'm going to sleep. <laughs> That's all guys' solution. Stop. Well, no. Sex. No, no, no. Sex. Nah, nah. Eating. I mean, not even, okay, what you want me to make you some motherfucking crab <laughs> macaroni cheese? And not tacos. like my baby boy. Man, I don't, I, man, it's like this, man. It's like, man, where am I at right now? Like, but, you know, in a way, it is double standards, though. But I don't think that... Even the picture I took with Ta- Taylor wasn't, like... not. It wasn't, like, my hand was on her ass or nothing right. like that. Like, But somebody might be intimidated. Like, she's a beautiful woman, like... 
But you know what I'm saying? That think, just makes think, it seem insecure. I don't think I'd be. Right? I don't it think is. I'd be. I think by the time we got that close, I know if she's built like that. Mm-hmm. Cause I'll let I'll let any woman. I, if I start catching feelings, I'm gonna let them know what they're getting into. You know what I'm saying? What is it? Like what would you I'm, say? Like, what it's been a long into? time. It's been a long time, long time since I've like been like in a like relationship publicly and everything. Like, but it's like okay. Do I know this person is intelligent enough? To understand how this this shit this this game goes. Do I know this person is not using me to as a as a stepping stone to get to in the world and get out and then get to another level and do what she want? Um, is this person uh, uh, is she well read? You know, is she gonna sound like like you know? I I mean I don't I would never date a woman that, that's not like intelligent. Like mm-hmm. I need I need I like I need another intellectual like to to vibe with. Cause you know you half of the problems is gone, Charlie. You know what this is. You know what I'm saying. You know how this game go. You know I do this for a living. You do that for a living. This is what you expect out of your job. This is what you gotta expect out of my job. She already know. So if if if, if we going together, or we or we're like borderline going together. She not even. She don't even mention that she to me. She wouldn't even trip. She wouldn't even mention it to me. Cause right. if she fell away about a picture, she gonna be falling away for the whole, lot of whole, stuff. whole life. Entertainment. So, you, so let me tell you. So let me get this right, Shorty. You want to be in all my videos? You want to be every girl in the video? <laughs> they do. That's a lot Some of CGI, do that. baby. That's a lot of CGI. You want to be every girl in my video? Because, I mean, I got to look at the girls in my video even more. I got to do more. So what? You know what I'm saying? Right. More than just this picture. Some That's people do C- do that, though. They be using their same boyfriend. You be like, all right, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you guys love each other. But I'm saying, yeah. I, don't, I, don't, I, don't think no, I don't think no girl should even really, you know, chip off that shit. Well, like, you're telling you the girls to black people. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> now, let's talk about, um, since we talked about Insecure and Issa Rae, the episode of Insecure where Issa Rae, uh, the guy she was dating, Nathan, went ghost. Yes. He just all of a sudden disappeared. disappeared. All right? And we're going to get Nathan into... Nathan is... Uh, the light-skinned guy. Oh, light, the, the light that, was the, that was the re- most recent yeah. episode. Yeah. I ain't and seen he that. Just, okay. I ain't seen. Uh, all right, so I'll tell well, you... Well, 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 I, I just got... I went to France, came to New York, went to L.A., came right back. So, so you, you, can't, it, yes. you can't stream on the goddamn plane. I'm motherfucking Wi-Fi slow as shit. All right, so the guy she was dating like just... 17 people. It's going to be all spread <laughs> and just moving like this. And he I just, wanna, he I just disappeared story. all of a sudden. She's been trying to call him. He's not answering. Yeah. Um, and yeah. she has no idea what happened. What are some reasons that guys go But ghost? she knows he's good because she reached out. he reached out to some someone else. Some people yeah. are scared of what they actually want. Yeah, you know I mean, I came up with this a long time ago. There's a luxury in saying and being able to say coulda, woulda, shoulda, because mm-hmm. in coulda, woulda, shoulda, you can control the narrative. Mm-hmm. You could be like, man. So I you go ghost a lot? No, yes. nah. I don't. I don't <laughs> like the coulda, woulda, woulda shoulda. Like, no, it depends. But ghost could be. What it was, I mean, like you just disappeared. Ghost. Like okay. You just stop some girl, to some the girls. Some girls are one. Some uh, girls. Gigi. Some girls are one night stand. Some girls are one night stand. A regular person, but because of what they think they can get out of certain people. They not, they not, there's no such thing as a one night stand. It's like, yo, you, I'm, am I still, you? Ten night stand. They yeah, want to be not around. even ten night stand. It's forever. <laughs> and right. I quit my job and like, what's up? Damn. You know what I'm saying? Not, I'm, I'm not just saying, wow. I mean, it's a lot it's of people. It's that good, huh? It's a lot of people. No, I'm just saying, that's the, that's the goal right there. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Well, Gigi, you wanted to bring something up. Did I? No, because you were saying you guys are friends and then Wale all of a sudden ghosted you. Yeah, that's He didn't what ghost me. What happened was... Look at and face. she wants to know what happened. Well, no. <laughs> Zoom in on his face. <laughs> let, me, let me go back to the conversation we had. So <laughs> me and this young gentleman right here had a really good friendship at one point. Cool. We, we were almost cool. like besties. We still cool. We spent a lot of time together. We still cool. Studio, yeah. in the crib, smoking, breakfast, airport runs. Yeah, just kicking it. like the therapist. <laughs> yeah, just kicking it, Breakfast. right? Um, like I was fr- in like, a relationship. Like friends do. Like friends yeah, we do. were friends. Yeah. Okay. Now, I was in a relationship, and I met him when I was with my significant and other. And I was fairly new to the industry, mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. I just, she was a great, like, mentor. Right. We was kicking it. Yeah. We, we, after we met, we were in Miami when we met. After we, <laughs> we met in Miami, we found out that we had mutual <laughs> friends in Atlanta. So when he would come to Atlanta, we would kick it in Atlanta, right? Then, somehow or another, I guess people would see us out or whatever, somebody went back and told my significant other that me and him were in some type of relationship. And that wasn't the case. I I didn't know that. Oh, shit. Yeah, that wasn't the case. So that's not why he went go. So... I was trying to figure my life. I was trying to... I think that was when I I got dropped. When it's going around that time. uh, I was trying to go. I was, like, working with everybody 24-7. Yeah, you was was doing a lot. It was around the time when you did the um, the No Hands verse. Yeah, yep. Mm -hmm. That was... It was around that Mm -hmm. time. Mm -hmm. So, anyway... um, 
it, it it became an issue between me and and my relationship at the time because he couldn't understand how me and Wale became so much close friends when we had just met when we were together. He's mm. like, you just met him with me. How are y'all besties now? And it, it, you click with people like that. Right. Like he said, we were friends. Like we're still, we still are friends. Good conversation. It's us, always been nothing but respect between me and him. And Wale's but, always been able to have female friends. And we've always we've run into each other through <laughs> the years at different events mm-hmm. and industry events and concerts and backstage and stuff like that. And it's always been respect. I just remember riding in the car and you just giving me game like shit like about just like everything from girls to the like the industry to like just like the club scene in everything. Atlanta cuz I was just starting to come to Atlanta a yeah. lot you know what I'm saying it wasn't Uber wasn't really back then and that like that like she be like what you, hey I'm like shit I ain't doing shit like let's, you know what I'm saying smoke a go to the studio or ride or ride around whatever and it's like oh, this shit is great like she don't look at me like girls back in DC do you know what I'm saying? Like they look at me like, oh my God, like like at that time, like, you know what I'm saying? It was just like a friend, like somebody that, you know, we sometimes 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 God put people in your life at the right time, like to save True. you from, yeah. from, from, from like when you right on the edge. Like again, I just left Innisco. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I know Big West used to drive drive, help me uh, help me around a little bit. Um I was torn good, so I wouldn't I wasn't broken down, but it's like mentally I was broken down like I was what like we had a lot of deep conversations. Right. Twenty three about so life. Then why did y'all not be friends anymore? It's not that we're not friends, but I mean it was the this the disrupt came when it was a problem with my significant other. So I just felt like let me just fall back. To oh, you cease fell back. Okay. Any I type didn't of know. I didn't know about this. I didn't know about that part. To though. cease any like, type let me pour of a drink. I yeah, didn't yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. I'm saying I'm supposed to be But I mean, I just but I like I I I always I, I forget every woman got a man most mm-hmm. times. But, I figured I just but it wasn't. That's a good but it wasn't. About. It That's wasn't. But it wasn't like about. he didn't know I had a man because he was with me. Right. I was with my man when we met. When so we it was met. all respectful, but it was. It was nothing but respect. Mm-hmm. But what happens is the outside. I, to be honest, I don't even know the, who the per, the man is, and I'm, maybe I should ask off the air because I'm. I don't know what's, what's about to happen. Mm-hmm. Okay. But I, I don't. I don't know. I didn't know who. The, I don't. I don't think I ever asked. We never had to talk about that because it never became an issue. Right, it wasn't. You understand? Like, because yeah. our relationship she wasn't. It. She yeah. got into Our friendship trouble. wasn't going yeah, in that way know. where I, I had to be like, oh, my yeah. man is da da da, yeah. da da da. Like, I ain't know. We just was kicking So know. now can y'all be friends? Like, we've right? never, in my <laughs> opinion, we've never, we've never, we've never stopped being friends. Out. Okay. Yeah. I like, mean, I've, like, it's it, but, interesting though that. But you know, people grow apart, like, grow apart just because of life. Like, like, I remember, I don't even know if you remember, like, like it was around the time. Maybe like the the tail end of how long like we was just talking and shit like mm-hmm. that, and you was like, man, I'm about to stop, I'm about to, stop. I'm about to do something else, like you know what I'm saying? And he was like, I'm about to have like a last big Jones or something yeah, like that. Yeah, that's why she got mm-hmm. wiped and up then, for real. And then, <laughs> I, and then um, I was just like, you know, and I think about this by this time I might have just signed with MMG maybe, yeah. and I'm just like, okay, you know what I'm saying? Um, my, I, it's like we both got new jobs mm-hmm. essentially. I guess that's the best metaphor to use. Okay, like I I, I got back. On, on, on a major label, you know, Doing my bu- my buzz was, at a, was higher than it was before I even signed with Interscope. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You kind of, like, skyrocketed at that point. And then, and then and you... And I was really deep into my relationship. And since there... It wasn't like it was a problem that me and you were friends. It's just that people on the outside looking in was... Kind yeah, of put my name in the song. Like, people was in this nigga What's the ear, line? Like, but the reason why <laughs> I put her name in the song is because it was just like... She's damn, talented. she's tight as shit at yeah. this jump. Like, it was you know the what respect saying? of what I did and how good I was at doing it. But maybe, like, line. you know, me being younger at that time, like, a muse. Like, like oh, again, okay. w- women are always my muse. Like, I, I can guarantee you that if you came to the studio with me, you probably hear, like, five or six times where you were my muse in a certain line. Because I'll think of all the women I know or that I'm cool with or that I got genuine love for, and I'll create, like, instances where they, like, where they can relate to you. Mm-hmm. Now you, you know see what, what I mean by the women love. I like, I like, I like, <laughs> yeah. I, 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 I relate. I, oh, my God, sure. now that I think I about think this, I'll... Wale dated a girl who didn't like me. Really? Wow. And he because dissed you, you in a record? Earlier, uh, something happened. She had an issue with me or I something. I want to know. You, we te- you want to text me the, text me the name? I can't before? remember. It was so long ago. It was like I years and years and years. Did he diss you in the record? It was when they had them comedy shows. Remember when Cypher Sounds used to do those comedy yeah, yeah, shows? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do remember. And I remember you I being I like... Didn't, I haven't dated that many women like that, like in the industry. And he Maybe like, she was dating you and you weren't dating her. You know, that happens. Yeah. That shit, that's deep. I was like, that damn. Yeah. <laughs> that, those one solid relationships are real. All right, now here's our. our um, I want to give me. Like, oh, yeah. Uh, oh, wait, but you before you, you go on. You don't respond to my, my, my DMs and shit. And I did DM you. Ah. No. Are you kidding me? No. That's a lie. I, hit you I the, see I all hit these. I you about the Yamin 
And then I was like, you was like, yeah, I mean, and I was like, yonden, yonden. You was like, theory, yeah. and I was like, yonden. Listen, and I just want to tell you it. something. I yeah, always try to, to hook. Say? No, 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 I'm not going to okay. say nothing crazy, right. but. <laughs> I was on the edge of my feet. Say something crazy. <laughs> I always try to hook Wale up, and he just don't step up to the plate. Like, I'd be like, oh, here's a nice so girl. He not, always, not always, not always. It was, it, was, it was a time. He's it was a time. It was a time. You know, I be wanting to she's, help him. She, Angela's very, like, like. I always look at Angela like somebody who's like seen me come up and like seen my highs and lows, and she was like, like my nigga, he, he's 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 a good person, like like, and I'm like, man, maybe I can't live up to the standards of. Oh, the, no. It's that, and a lot of her friends are like, come on, like come on, like I know like six niggas that try to talk to you, like. And oh, they got so a lot down. of her friends fall into that category of you don't know what their past might have been and what we talked about earlier. But I, and I, you know what I told him? I said, well, of course you're gonna like girls that other guys like. Why would you like? Why would you like them and if I, other and, people didn't like them? And I told her, and I told her that was profound. <laughs> that that was sounds profound. crazy. That to was me. profound. Of course you're gonna like. I don't girls know, that, man. Like sometimes. How do you think girls feel when they want to talk to you? They probably think like. I, I've never. I, I, it's been a long time since I met a girl who's like, like did I know. Like that we speak cordially. That that was like, yo, you know what I'm saying? I bring like I bring this to the table. Like just let's, just so you know, not mentally whatever all that. Like I bring this to the table, and I, I and I, like you know what I'm, I'm trying to see where this can go. Like Cause it, I don't in, even, in any kind of way. I be wanting while later like kick it to certain people, they don't and he want, won't but, do it. But I don't know like. He wants a stripper, Angela. No, I don't. Find a stripper. No, I friend. don't. It's just like I want <laughs> at this point. I just want you to have something going for yourself. You know what I'm saying? And just be passionate about something. We're going to find Wale a woman. A nah, stripper like, no, with a business. Because I ain't trying to do an interview and I'm talking about it. We're going to find you. And you it know, never I happens. Don't care. No, I don't even. I just want I just to, I just say, want to be I've passionate. tried and it's been some really quality, quality. Man, it's been like one time for real. No. It was and one time. I think he hella years picky. Years and years and years of this. Maybe. Knowing him the way I I was friends with him, and he is hella picky. I think it's just the I don't even think I'm picky like that. I'm just like, yo, have something to the table. But then it's also like, and this is my flaw. My trust issues are so immense. That you trust it, yourself? That I trust myself more than because I trust anybody else. Because you have to trust else. yourself first. Yeah. I trust myself more than I trust anybody else. Like, I literally got issues, like, like, you know, issues with, within my family that make it hard. That, like, damn, like, this happened within my family. Like, I, I'm, I'm really can't trust. Like, or I've known somebody for 12 years and then this happened. You know what I'm saying? Or, like, you know... I had a friend in college that was that was killed by his own man, and then one of my best friends in school was killed by his own man, like on some open the door and play Madden with you and then smoke you and rob you, like. So my trust is like so distorted and mm. so weird, and you know you see stuff like certain basketball players getting taken for child support for like all like like forty five percent of what they 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 working for, like mm. it's just like man, you know what like. How can you blame me? And then it's like the girls that's with the secret phone shit, like trying mm. to get you snoring and oh, shit. Oh, yeah, that shit. All that, is like, yo, right. like, like. I know, know this girl that takes pictures of guys without them looking so she can have that as insurance in case he try to act up. That shit is so Yeah, that's not See, that's too much. But then, it's, but, then, cool. but then it's a problem when a nigga be like, hey, but hey, before we kick it, like, can around, you put, can your I, you put your phone away? Like, but then it's, it, now it's awkward. The dynamic between y'all is she, yeah, she might still want to fuck Yeah, that would be like that. She, would, I would be like, yeah, I can't she, fuck yeah, with this yeah, nigga. Yeah, but even if she was, go, either way, you're going to get the bad one. Mm -hmm. If she was going to do it, now she mad she can't do it. And if she wasn't going to do it, she's insulted. Right. Yeah. So either way, you know what I'm saying? So, like, how you relax? How do you relax no, and let your guard down? It's that's hard to be a rapper nowadays, a male rapper. And, then, and, and let them get to you. I'm sorry for touching your thigh because you oh, know everybody Oh, he touchy Philly now. You better watch <laughs> out. No, because I just said I got a little nostalgic. Because, man, it was it was times where like I was I was really trying to figure out my neck. You know what I'm saying? Like, like shit. I don't know if she could see that in me or whatever, but she knew a little bit. Like, it's, it's, that's why like I, I was just trying to like get it together. Because it takes me back to a time where I'm like, I didn't know what was going to happen, mm -hmm. for real. I mean, but things was good, though, because I was recording with Tip. I was recording with Gucci. I was recording with Gotti. You know, Reese had me in the studio with, like, every fucking Everybody. body in Atlanta. He was all up in I was Atlanta. everywhere. He was Magic on Monday. Yeah, I was everywhere. I was, I was enjoying it. He was in the H. Was he a, a good too. tipper in Magic? I had, a, I had a bag with no, no, I had a bag yeah. with no uh, a radio buzz. You know what I'm saying? So I was, I was enjoying it. And he went in that studio session with Waka and did that No Hands. 
verse, was, and that was it over. Skyrocketed. Yeah. It was so late that, that night. That shit was bro. the bounce back. It was so late <laughs> at night, bro. I was tired, and I, <laughs> it's crazy. Story behind that record. I, I, I went out. Gucci. That was the day Gucci had his dinner, and I went out. I went out. I went to like four places. Man, I'm so drunk, so high, so tired. And and I and I, I remember I was waiting for Gucci and that's when I that's when I met Reese for real. I was like, yo, you got a charger? My phone about to die. <laughs> so I charged my phone up a little bit, waited for Gucci. I was, you know what I'm saying? The engineer was in, like, man, he ain't coming. He probably he probably tired too. You know what I'm saying? So I was like, cool, I'm about to leave. So I charged my phone and I was leaving out. I was with my man, Sneaker Man Dan, I'll never get it. And then uh Reese, who I didn't really know that well at the time. He's like, yo, walk in there. He want to do a song with you. And I was like, damn, man. Like, <laughs> said, I, I fuck with this nigga shit hard, bro. This nigga's cold. You know what I'm saying? I'm so tired. I was like, yo, damn. Just tell him to email the record. I'm going to do it tomorrow. <laughs> like, please. I'm like, you know what I'm saying? And then, like, you know, I ain't know Reese at the time, but she looking like, like, what, nigga, what you want to do? Like, tomorrow. Atlanta, like, you better get in there. Atlanta, Atlanta, niggas, in there. Atlanta niggas just do the song. Just like, do the shit. So I'm like, all right, cool. You know what I'm saying? And, and Dan was like, bro, just suck it up, bro. You, 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 you just like, we just working, man. We just, but mind you, I was in, I've been in four clubs. <laughs> Lord knows what was in my drink, what I put in my drink. Lord knows what. <laughs> 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 no, nah, it, it was a different time. Back in the day. It was a different time. It was a different time. <laughs> but... They put the beat on, you know what I'm saying? But you killed I, it, though. I'm already socially awkward. Mm -hmm. He had all, like, a couple niggas in there. I'm just with my man. I'm like, yo. Are you? Yo, 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 yo. Mm -hmm. I'm very socially awkward. That's what I'm thinking. But <laughs> I dialed him up, and then I was like, yo, let's play that jump. And then I went into this little small room, because I was like, I don't want them to know how weird I am when I'm writing. Because <laughs> I be, like, on the, like sitting upside down. I be just think, I be on some wild shit when I'm writing. <laughs> so I, I wrote the verse. I was like, man. I was like, damn. I rushed this joint. Like I, wrote, like I wrote in like like seven or eight minutes, it was very fast. Mm. And I was like, bro, I rushed it. I'm like, no, don't, don't, don't try to like clown me in the car. Like, you know what I'm saying? And I was like, he's like, no, he's like, nah, bro, you got it, bro. He was like, bro, and he was fucked up too. He was like, right. man, damn, when he's, when he's when he's when he's high like drunk like this, like, he's like, bro, it doesn't matter. You can rap. You 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 never let me down. Like, he's always gonna go. <laughs> So I went in the booth and I did that job. I was like, bro, when, right before I went in the booth, I was like, yeah, bro, don't, don't, don't clown this verse, bro. Like, cause it's and no, that's crazy because everybody's in the studio listening yeah, it, too. It, it, that's got to feel crazy. It's, it, it, I felt crazy. <laughs> so I did the verse. One take though, right? I did it one take and I was like, all right. I, I took the headphones off and I was like, okay. I, I didn't do, I didn't do no, like if you listen to it, there's no ad libs, there's no backgrounds, there's no nothing. Because at that time I didn't I hated doing it. I didn't like that. I, I just wanted my voice. And I was like, I just hope it's like okay. And then I got out, I walked out the booth and Waka was like, and I saw Dan with his hat, like like this, like. That's the most memorable uh, verse on that, that shit is like seven that, times yeah. platinum, like <laughs> that's seven times platinum. But like, you know, my, my style of rap is like a little different in it. I can go I can dip in and out of that lane. But though. that's the versatility of it. Yeah. Is that I think you can go into all these different lanes. Like you could do the strip club banger, but then you can do like the lyrical, but then you could do the Lady sweet Gaga women's record. song. Then you can do the all trades and master of none. Oh, stop Don't say it. That. You've had so much more success than <laughs> I mean, so many people, I know, so I, I can't know, master. say. Master. Master? Uh, is the omnipotent, mm -hmm. number one, top dog. Right? The master would be the rapping, period. The master of rapping, because you got all the other shit down. No, like, yeah, I'm not, not, I'm, no, no. I'm thinking about a different the jack, of a genre. The jack, the jack of all trades is like, I could, I could rap good on everything. Like, maybe I haven't mastered it because I can't do it on a level where the people, it, it, it falls right into the culture every single time. You know, Maybe I'm, people are used to the certain shit over and over and over and they're brainwashed. So when they hear something else, <laughs> they think that it's different or whatever the I've, case. I have one I have one request. I'm not going to ask who's heard the new project. Because Free lunch, so, we all listen yes, to it. Because sometimes people don't... No, no, it's, sometimes they haven't. But um, I just want everybody... Uh, if you, if you want to be like, all right, let me give Wale a chance of listening to what's, what he got going on. I want them to listen to three days and three hours. Okay. Um, I want them to because that is it. Kind of shows you what I bring to the table as far as like an artist and like 
I try to make music that feels like you can see it. When I make songs like that, I feel like you can close your eyes. Even you guys now that have heard it already, I think you should close your eyes and listen to Three Days and Three Hours. Um, some people have got the concept already, and some people it's growing on. Because if you hear it in passing, if you heard it in the Uber or while people are talking to you, you're not going to get it. Mm -hmm. But I'll explain it now because when I do this, the, the, all my songs spike up. But um, <laughs> it was uh, it's about a long distance relationship, and um, it's four thirty it's four thirty in Eastern time where you ask Shorty, in the AM I'm saying though, you know where you ask Shorty, I'm happy without you, but got my doubt Shorty, like and and it's based, I started off like saying all right I'm in the, I'm on the West you on the East yeah I heard but that. I miss you <laughs> so it's three days. Three hours, you know what I'm saying? Like that's like that's the time. I'm three hours back, and I'm three in three days until I see you. Mm -hmm. The first verse is like a late night call. Second verse, if you hear me, it's 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 me getting off stage. That's why it's like, uh, yo, did she it's call me? Did she call me? And I lost my voice. Yeah, like, you can hear I lost like my, my voice. Mom. I'm like, y'all, like you know what I'm saying? And um, I just performed. In, I just performed in the crowd. I only seen your face in. So basically, I'm saying, like, I just did, like, a fucking big stadium, but all I could see yeah, was your yeah. face. Mm -hmm. But she's sleeping. You know what I'm saying? She's sleeping. That's why I'm leaving the voice message on the second verse, right? And the third verse, I'm around the corner. I'm home now because the three days is up. I'm home now. Like, you know what I'm saying? And that's why I say um, we, two, uh, 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 we two days away from celebrating that, that very tomorrow is today or some shit like that. I said some shit like that. And that basically means I'm right. I'm like, this is, is I'm going to see you tomorrow. You know what I'm saying? And I'm around the corner and I'm, I'm writing, a, I'm, I'm reciting a poem for the third verse. Like everything that I say is I'm around the corner. Some people don't get that because the way we train to listen to music is different now. But I feel like once people put that shit together and put that all together, it's going to go. Like, but that's how I write now. That's the writer that I've evolved three into. Three days, three hours. Let's make sure we re-listen. Yeah. Did you get all that? Yeah, I you listened here. to it and I understood it. You well, understood you know, all the I understand different because I did music for mm -hmm. most of my life. So when I heard it, I'm like, this is dope. Obviously, you're a West Coast, East Coast. You know what I mean? It's yeah, two yeah. different coasts. Because once I heard the three hours already, obviously, that's obvious. But a lot of, you know, and then, and then since you've been in music, you know that a lot of people listen to the beat and hook first. And that's it. And that doesn't do that song. That doesn't yeah. do that particular song justice right. at you all. You got to really pay That's what I like saying. about your music, though. Like, you li you make people think, like, you got to listen to you. And but most I'm, not, I'm not afforded that luxury no more. See, I'm I, not, I'm I, not afforded that luxury because you're, you, you, you're smart and you know music, right? Mm -hmm. I'm not afforded that luxury for people to go back and re-listen and be like, yo, they even going to be like, yeah, and they probably in the first 15 seconds because of whatever narrative that, that, that they've got. You know what I'm saying? Three days, three hours. Like, you got to you gotta go back and like, you got to go back and listen to it. I need to see some think pieces on it. I need to see some college kids making short movies to that joint. Three days, three, three days, three hours, bro. Everybody understands what a long distance relationship, the strain it is. Mm. But everybody also understands the passion that happens when you, you unite with that soul or and that they, person that you with. People right, always say with long distance relationships, you know each other better because better you spend so much more time talking. Wow, like, I never heard true. that. Really like FaceTiming mm -hmm. each other, talking on the phone. Such a, not, it's such a, it's such a, it's such a negative connotation behind uh, long distance relationships now though. But I never heard you get to know each other. But it makes total sense, though. Yeah, it does. The temptations, I feel like, My from both sides. Or, like, even with men, I feel like there's a lot of temptations and easy access with, like, women and Instagram and stuff like that. Well, think about it. He I want to so love somebody so much that I need her. I want to love somebody so much that I need her that she can get to me as soon as possible. Mm -hmm. I want to love somebody that is in a position that can do that. If, 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 I, if I got to... So the money's not the issue. Getting you a flight ain't the issue. But, like... The procedure and doing that, I might not have the time to do that. I'm right. doing interviews all day. I'm just doing it. Like, I want to see like, hey, Charlotte, like, hey, man, I miss you, like, shit. Yeah, well, I miss you too, and I just took off. I'm about to come. I'm about to come fly up there. That's when you get into that level. Of, like, this ain't my. This ain't my. We ain't, we ain't just fucking around. Mm -hmm. Like, she gonna come see me. Like, the spontaneity. She, she spontaneity, but she also got her own. It's 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 a multiple thing because I don't care about my little five hundred dollar flight, whatever. Like. But it's more so like I can just get on a plane and do this because I like this nigga. Like, it's, it's it means multiple things. It means one on the flat surfaces, I got enough money to do this I'm a boss. Spontane spontaneously. I got enough money to do this. Mm -hmm. Two, I really really miss you, dog. Like I really miss you, dog. Yes. What if people because take you that my, differently? You my you my friend at this point. Like I really, I miss mm -hmm. you. I miss the little things about you. Three, it's like 
Slim, you really doing like you doing this? Like you 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 thought enough? That's that's why I haven't really rec- I haven't received a birthday present from a, a woman that say she really liked me, like a thoughtful one. Mm-hmm. You've gotten presents, just ever, not thoughtful ever. ones. Oh, thoughtful, ever. okay. That's like different. a pair of J's. Like nigga, I got all the J's. Like, right. Yeah. I don't you know, what the fuck? Never what the fuck? I work at the gas station. Uh-huh. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like you could get something that's what? way cheaper. What a like gas something station. like a <laughs> oh I got a, I got a record like um I got a record I got this uh obscure record that maybe oh I heard in the interview that you that your guilty pleasure is wake me up before you go go. Like you know what I'm saying? Yeah, by, the by the wham, I got the vinyl for you. Like it's a funny gift, but I I framed it and it's in a it's in a joint we put but on the wall. That's some creative shit. Some people are not I that need creative. I a woman that has that <laughs> element to her. Right. Okay. That that's what sense. I'm saying. Like I, I tweeted the other day. If you're if you're not creative, do not date a creative. Save yourself. Yeah, okay. True. Well, that makes sense. Save yourself. Not even the fact of being creative, but open minded. Uh, that too. But when you're dealing with somebody who can do just about anything for themselves, you have to go to the thoughtful. Yeah, because you have the money, to be creative. The money value don't really matter when it's somebody that can buy 18 of what you just bought them. Very true. At once. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's the fact that you took the, th- the thought out to really make it a personal, thoughtful gift or something that you know that person is really going to appreciate. But- and then it's like, I got, the, I got a little part of me that's a little bit like, okay, um, I, I feel like I'm a... I'm a I, I'm overly kind a lot sometimes, you know what I'm saying? But like, okay, let's say it's a girl that does, that is a painter, mm-hmm. but I'm not a fan of her work. <laughs> like just, I'm not, I don't think just because you like somebody, you gotta like they, you know what I'm saying? Right. Okay, So right. like, I'm not gonna like, <laughs> you know, um, uh, I might feel weird about the painting. I'm gonna love it for another reason, mm-hmm. cause at a time and effort. But you're not gonna hang but it up from in the a, living from room. But from a taste perspective, <laughs> It's not my style. I, I, you know what I'm saying? I, I, and and, and if, it, if it makes her happy, I'll put it up. Mm-hmm. But I will, you know, maybe find a way to be like, yo, like, you know. Can we put it in the garage? Not, but, but again, again, <laughs> again, again. Put it in now, the guest now if, <laughs> if I knew this was her passion and she wanted to do this, I, 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 I would just pay for her to go learn it, like, better. Okay. Or learn from different people or put her around people that do that. I'd pay for it. Has a girl ever gotten a tattoo of you on her? That's not a fan, like someone you're dating. Yeah, my baby. Oh. Okay. Okay. We was good. We was. We was. Man, that was my like. I was my best friend for a while, but when it was when it started to deteriorate, um, it just made me. I just didn't love myself as much because it was certain things that she would say to me that would really hurt me. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, and I'm 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 I'm, I'm the only thing that could hurt me is my family and my career for real. My family, my career is the only thing. Like, you know what I'm saying? If you're my close friend, you're my family. So, you know, if if, if um, I got a close friend that, like, they lost their job and then they, they got to figure it out, I'm hurt. I got to leave Mac, even Mac Miller, God bless him. You know, I talked to him three days before he passed. Like, that's family. That hurt me. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Career stuff, like, man, it's, everybody hate me. Like, what did I do? When did I become the villain? Like, that hurt me. You know what I'm saying? And when you have kids, that shit is another pain. If somebody use your kids and put your name in a negative connotation any kind of way, it that shit hurt like unbelievably. That's on another can't, level. Can't mm-hmm. sleep though. You know what I mean? Like and it's something that you really can't even explain and I never talk about it. Right. I never talk about that side. I never talk about like you know, I always talk about the 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 respect and, and, and admiration I have for my daughter's mother for being such a good mother. But I never talk about the pain that comes with a fa- being a father on the road. Mm-hmm. I'm not Kevin Lyles or, you know, Russell Simmons, where it's like I could fly my daughter, a nanny, her mother, and everything with me. Teachers. And and I could do and everything. Man. Like, I wish I was. Right. And I'm going to keep grinding until I can maybe be that. If I can be that or if, if I got to go, then she she's good. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm a, I'm gonna I'm gonna do everything I can to be like that dad that can do that as she get older cuz she's only 2 now. Mm-hmm. So I got a little time to cook up stuff. You know what I'm saying? I got some time. But I made the decision within myself like, yo, I do a lot to make her and her mother happy. I'm gonna try to find some happiness myself. Right, you have to. I I and that's why when we talked at the party, I was like, yo, let's talk soon because I got to figure it out. Right. On a personal level, you know we can't have we can't have that conversation. We can't have this conversation in the Breakfast Club. We can't because Charlamagne would have cut cut in with an insensitive joke by now. <laughs> but we like I, I I gotta find it or 
I'm a, I'm a I'm gonna probably break down. No, it's a black, fact. Black Bonnie is a real thing. Yes, it's an idea of a woman that that. Black Bonnie. Even if mm-hmm. even if she don't work, but if she's dedicated to helping your brand and keeping your brand and all, and like and like dedicated to you and shit like that. Like at this point in my life, I wouldn't even do no prenup if she was dedicated like that. Mm-hmm. Like my woman, my everything, my, my 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 whole globe, my whole universe. I'm not even gonna do no prenup. I, I'll be like, man, shit, man, you helping me just like a manager would, and, but it's also you my girl too, so. Do you feel like you passed up on some good girls before that you should have maybe pursued more with? Nah, mm-hmm. I don't. I think the girls that, I think I lost them to 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 other men or to, um, maybe I fucked up. Cause Cause sometimes I, 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 got feel like, I got a temper. Sometimes I feel like things are timing too. Like sometimes you could be with somebody great, but for you, you're not ready. To accept that into so you your gotta life. Let him go, I just, or... I just, I just announced to my friends. I'm like, yo, you think? I think I'm ready. I think I'm ready. Like I'm ready to at least try. And the the one obstacle I got it, the hurdle over is the, the trust thing. Cause it's like, I kick it with a girl, and it'd be like, oh, sh- I can't even enjoy this bride. My bad. This girl, bride ain't bad. Bride ain't bad. Yeah. That's probably like better than thing, girl. Isn't better. I, I think it's better than bitch. I can't, or I, can't I can't enjoy. The, I can't enjoy this, this girl company. Because I'm, I'm like really right now. I'm thinking like, yo, why, why you like me like that? What you think? Everything is every moment is gonna be low. This flower bomb. You think every, you think every <laughs> why moment. Why would you say that? You no, know, because because no, of, no, my, 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 no. my, my sister told me she's like when we was on, on she's like she's like the idea of you girls like the idea of you because you you know you 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 got the rowdy persona. I mean, I'm rowdy in real life, but like you got the rowdy when you when you mad and you yelling and like, but you also like got a book full of poems. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? That will connect with women. But listen, let me ask you this: What's the worst thing that'll happen? Right? Say you date a girl and it just doesn't work out. What's the worst? I mean, you have, I think you that a, you if have you a child, you have a child together. Your, if you don't that's put the worst yourself, thing that can happen. But that's the best child. thing also that can no, happen. No, no, for no. You. you have the, it, as far as like conflict. No, no. And children I, are. I want to have more children. Because I, 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 I really think that a it's about get into something, but take your time with it and enjoy it. Right, and you don't gotta rush into it and say, "When I start dating somebody, this is somebody you have to be with. This is my be all end all. I have to trust them right away." Of course not. But why not just go into something to have a good time, enjoy it, take it slow, yeah. and see where no, it goes see, instead yeah. of overthinking. The, the, the animal out. instinct in me, right? <laughs> yeah. I just think that, like, like okay, uh, okay. Before my baby mother, I had another girl. We 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 was real real close. Then the one before her, right? This is when I, this my, at this point, I'm still working at the shoe store in DC, right? We were super intimate. The first night, the first night we 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 kicked it. Mm-hmm. We ended up being together, and like even to this day, like I don't know where she at, whatever. I think she got like two kids now somewhere. Where she she she, she, was, she danced for a while too, but like I remember like her giving me a stack. A stack, like at this point in my life, I was maybe like 21. Give me a stack to go to Atlanta. Like, I don't know. I know these labels trying to holler at you. You need some money. Like, like she set the bar mm-hmm. for those type of women. But mm. this is also the same person that she 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 got. Um, how do I say this without Aaron? I don't want to know why I put the puzzles together back home. She got real sick, and I took care of her. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Working double and making sure she had everything she needed and what the woo. And the, at some point, for no reason at, at, at all, she cheated when she got healthy. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Um, and it kind of, I think, and you know, all girls be like, oh, you always, you hopping over some girl from years ago. Da, 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 da. And you guys were young. But females do that. Um, I just think that, yeah, yeah, it's, it's petty and it's, 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 it's immature. But whatever, I love fucking uh, uh, Marcus Houston and those guys. Immature, <laughs> I love immature. I am X. Yeah, I love. BTK. I was like, she cheated with Marcus Houston. Nah. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's, Batman. It's, it's, Marcus Houston be getting it. It's immature though, but it's it's a part of me though. It's really still a part of me. Yeah, because um, when you're young and immature, you make that's when you're supposed to make mistakes. You learn from them. Man, I remember dri- I was I had the flu, man. I didn't go to school, nothing. I just I mean I speed in running red lights to her house just to argue. Cause so I was did like, you find man, out she cheated on you? Yeah. How you found out? 
If I tell you, you're going to think I'm psycho. Nah, oh we want to know. We already nah. know you are. No, nah. yeah, nah, it's a different level of Dexter. What did you do? And you're a Virgo, CSI, so you're a psycho like, already. Investigation, like <laughs> he was having like, a little pool in there. This pubic hair has a... <laughs> <laughs> Let me go and get this tested. No. First of all, I think she... First of all, I think... She, I think <laughs> man, I don't want her to... I hope she you don't see this. You got a microscope? I don't want... Because I don't... Because I, okay, I got nothing but love and respect. I'm not trying to throw her under the bus. But we don't even know what she does. I think... No, but... But how did you find out? But if she listened to it, then she might... First of all, I think she was fucking... She had like like a bitch, too. Like, I think she had a bitch. Oh, shit. Well, then... At that point, I, at, in that point in my life, I cared a little bit. Like if I, if 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 you if you fucking with a broad, I, I don't I don't think I would really care. If but if, at that point if, you yeah you I did. Mm-hmm. And but she then if then sharing. it was like I found out like she you know she was open to a lot of niggas like a lot of niggas was like hollering. She was receiving it and she kicked it with a couple of niggas. Whether it happened or not is between them and them two. But I knew it and mm-hmm. I, that, and I, that that kind of shaped me. Oh, okay. And then I had a, um, then I, I was really infatuated with this girl in the industry um, early in my career. And I was so, I felt so like I wasn't on her level. I felt like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> What's so funny? Nah, because we seen you take that little sip right, right. then before you kept going into Stop it. Stop being so observant. You know? <laughs> I was just like, you know, I was so enamored with, with everything she was, how, how creative she was, and how free she was and she was like I mean obviously she was a big star and I'm you know uh and I was just like enamored with her and I was just ready like you know I was like head over heels like for real like anything and, like you know I'm not rich like this person had like right a lot more than I could ever have and I was just so enamored with her spirit her drive her creativity Every spontaneity, it was just all the boxes was checked. And I remember just, uh, I remember being wherever I was. I, well, I'm not trying to leave too many clues, but I remember I was, <laughs> I remember I just heard like, yo, I'm, I'm getting back on my ex. Mm. And that was like one of the saddest days. Like, I'm trying to hold it tight, you know what I'm saying? But I'm like, and I think I think I kind of changed forever that day. Mm. Forever. Like, I, I didn't become this, the super villain. Maybe so your heart I, maybe was I became twice. The, maybe I became the antihero. I was just it about says to say twice. That. Yeah, it's like your heart was broke twice, and that's why. And you can't really. I mean, I feel like that happens to to women. Maybe it's karma. Maybe it's karma. It happens to a lot of people. It happens to a lot of people. Yeah. But yeah, I'm saying, happens. like, we carry sometimes we carry stuff with us. I don't think your heart could be broken identically twice. No, of course because not. Because after it's the first one, it's like it don't hurt as much. It's a little armor. And up. if it happens mm. two or three times, you turn into like. Shh. Uh, you think you hurt my feelings? Watch it. Watch me hurt your feelings. Hey, best friend of person, sad person. That's true. Come through. Go, best friend. Go, best friend. Uh, that's, that's my, my best, best friend. friend. <laughs> that's my best friend now. Uh, you know what I'm saying? No, no, but no. for real, like, no, you know, like, you know how to push people buttons for real. Like, right. women, women know how to do it way more than men because women know how to hold that shit together. I, I definitely know how to press buttons, but I think like the first time I got my heart broke, I was like, I'm never gonna let this happen again. So the second time that it happened, it was worse for me. But I think it was because I was older, I lived with the person. The first time was like my first love. Like, you know, I was still kind of young growing up, but I was devastated. But when I lived with, that was the only person I ever lived with in my life, whatever. Yeah. And when yeah. me and him broke up, it was like worse to me. So I feel like you do I, put I live, your I live with up, a girl. But... I lived with a girl one time and, and I found out like, like I was, uh, all right, fuck it. Well, it's happened? the drink. It's the drink. Yeah, we what all. Um, out? <laughs> uh, uh, I, one day we lived in a small. Uh, I'm not trying to drop clues because I don't want no smoke. Just tell us what happened. You I went through her phone. I went through her phone. It was less technology back then, so I could <laughs> go. I could kind of. I could kind of figure it out, like right. And you know, I had been out of the country for a while, and I seen like me me at the station, and smiley face, and all that, like. And I just, I stopped going, though, because I could have kept going, and I just stopped. You knew what it was. I'd have went through all of it. I don't want to know. That's I don't how I am. Mario Wine to the time of time. Hey, 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 keep it on the low. Because my heart can't take it anymore. Come on, Diddy, you ready, Diddy? No? 
No. All right. No. Nah, everybody, 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 oh, everybody baby. in this room that tapped their foot or bobbed their head to that felt that. Sweetie, got some shit. Oh, okay. Yeah. Right. Yeah, you got to the first. That, that's a different type of hurt. That's a different type of hurt. I thought I was done drinking. I'm not. not. No. I said, where's that gin? So wait, Tessa, you went through a phone, saw that, and... I just know. Ice. I don't even remember what happened, but I just know it didn't last much longer after that. And then you were living together, so now that's a whole yeah. separation. And I was so young, so I was like... Looking back, and I'm like, why am I even living with somebody? Like, you know what I'm saying? But whatever. Like, the thing is, I got love for Shardy still, though. Like, uh, we grown apart, we grown up, and we grown apart. Like, I don't even bring it up. So y'all still cool? What we, if she came cool. back and wanted we're you cool. back? We're cool. And she flew I think out. She's one of the most beautiful women I've ever, like, physically beautiful women I've ever known. And her family is amazing, like everything, but. I uh, know, I you know, like like Gigi said, like people grow apart. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, people just grow apart. Um, like I don't want to bring, like, the, all the the, the 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 nights I can't sleep and the the the, the torment of the industry. I don't want to bring that into nobody, no relationship. I'm not ready. Yo, like you just said, you was ready. I'm confused. no, not ready for that part. Oh, oh. That part. <laughs> like, like like okay, like for instance, like I want to keep everybody away from like. All right, for instance, okay, um, um, when Mac passed away, like, let's say I had, a, like, a girl, a, a living girlfriend or something like that, and she's trying to console me. I probably would have argued with her, and I don't know why. Well, I do know why, because, I mean, I mean fuck this all. Hurt people, I, I hurt tried people. To, I tried... No, I was in my mind. I was in my head. So, you know what it's like. You we need are, a we, space. I, I need I, I don't know what I needed. That's the problem. I don't know what I needed. I just know when I found out, J. Cole called me, and I, the, 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 the message got to me in a weird way because somebody, with, Reese was, I think Reese was trying to tell me, your friend, like your boy, I thought, and I, I, I don't know, you know, her accent thing, I just brushed it off, and I'm like, I'm in the booth, I'm making a song, and I keep getting a lot of texts, but my joint doesn't show. And then Cole told me. You know what that means. Cole called me, and then he told me, and like, I went through the stages of grief in like 15 seconds. Mm -hmm. Like, it was like crazy. I was like, nah, no, no. He was like, yes, bro, yes, bro. No, 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 nah, nah. And then Mm -hmm. they just started going like, it just, I couldn't stop. So I'm pacing the house, I'm walking outside, I come back down. <laughs> a little, it's a, here's a little small, beautiful moment in this. I don't know if somebody told my daughter or what, but like she came outside with a cookie. She's like, "Daddy's sad." Kids can always tell when, That's you, so when you go. Sweet. She's so like, "Daddy's sad." But kids can always tell when you. And I was like, "Kids are very sweet like that." I said, "I was." I'm talking about my eyes were my eyes were maroon. I was like, "No, daddy's not sad." So I was like, "No, daddy's not sad." She's like, "Oh, okay." And then I just took the cookie and I just ate a little piece. And I just laughed a little bit, paced a little bit, and started crying more. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, that night, I literally could have been in, 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 like an insane asylum. Literally. If I, what if I had a living girlfriend that moment? Like, mm-hmm. she she wouldn't understand, like, the pain. There was pain. There's pain inside me that nobody know, bro. Like, the, 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 uh, the 30th, Mac, uh, Mac sent the text to me on the 30th. He's like, yo, bro, I want you to cameo in this video. You know what I'm saying? I was like, bro, I don't know, man. I got, I'm about to go see my daughter. I'm about to, I'm about to be in DC. I don't know, but if I can, I got you. Like, woo. And like, you know, the day before I left LA, John Geiger, one of our mutual friends, I was like, Geiger. yo, he was like, um, yo, we at Max House. Yo, come through. And I was with Hit Boy all day making music. And I was like, man, nah, nah. In my mind, though, I was like, I want to, you know, I want to holler at Mac, cause like. You know, I sent him this long ass message the day his album came out. Like, right. bro, be proud of that shit. Like, I hope you can smell the roses and all that. Like, and he's like, bro, it feels amazing. He was such in a good spirit. But I, I, I noticed he was up late. And, you know what I'm saying? I'm, you know, I, you know, not on some judgy shit. Like, cause I know how the game go. But I wanted to be like, yo, um, you know, not on some judgy shit. Cause he know, cause we we dealt with the same struggles. So I wanted to go. I was like, man, I'm gonna just do it next time I come back. Ain't no next time. And the next time, the, the last text that he sent me was like, you, and I ain't go. And so 
I'm dealing with the pain of losing somebody that I could really confide in, mm-hmm. but also knowing like, damn, I ain't even fucking hit him back. You know what I'm saying? Like, I didn't even... And it's not even on those in, industry shit. It was like, I believe when he hit me, I might have been, like, going through, like, baggage claim or something like that. It was, like, a weird time where it was, like, in my mind, I knew I was probably going to hit him, like, right. oh, yeah, what's up, my nigga? Like, I was like... And it's just, you know, that there is a heavy tag that comes with dealing with a person that deals with pain like mm. that. I... Not my biggest fear, but one of my fears is dealing with a woman that... They look at that shit like, yo, this nigga's tripping. Like, cause I'm, I know I'm not normal. I, like, I'm hot and cold. That I'm, is I'm just, normal though, to no, have emotions. No, no, hot, being hot and cold ain't normal. The, the levels the of highs hot and cold. And the lows. I'm not okay. normal with that. Like, so like who my, do? So who do you talk? Like, do you feel like you have problems expressing yourself when you need to and talking about things? That's the when same you need thing to? we talked about. Me and my sister, like, right there. Like, so. Nigerians, right? A lot of us, a lot of us that like in my family, I can speak for my own own family. A lot of us deal with like we like are the men. A lot of times, not all, but a lot of times we're not good at being gentle. Like not because we're not because we're trying to be violent. Or not, it's just that we don't have that like oh how you raised. We don't have that. Yeah. I, like our we don't have tough. that. Like I've never seen my parents kiss before. Mm-hmm. I've never. I, I I could count on one hand how many times my mother has. Physically said, I love you. They never came to my games. I was one of the top athletes in the in the in the county. They never came to my stuff. My father was always in Nigeria, or always on at work. You know what I'm saying? So I, you know, we don't. I'm not. I was never quote unquote friends with my parents right. ever in my life. And then imagine a young nigga, you know, 13 years old in a juvenile little school like, where, where my PL was in the, was in the basement and it was ver- six people to a class for the security and all that. Like, So imagine, imagine, yeah, I was very bad. I mean, imagine that. And then imagine getting, you had, to, you, had to go, you had to go to that facility on a small yellow bus so people think that you like, you're not, you're not like normal, them. Normal, right? Yeah. yeah, you're not normal. So it's like, then you come home, you know, it's that. So you don't see love in the house. You know what I'm saying? You don't get love because you are the, the bad child or whatever. And your parents aren't from this country. They don't they don't express themselves the, the way that most people do. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And um, I got maybe two uncles, maybe out of the hundred uncles I got <laughs> that 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 expressed it. And one of them, one of her father, one of he he know he knew how to he knew how to give love to the young. Kids in the, you know what I'm saying? You know, I remember he bought me a pair of J's when I was like in like, like one of my first pair of J's in like seventh grade, sixth grade or whatever. Like, I never got that type of love from my father and I don't even blame him. I blame, you know, the culture, you know, that they grew up on right. and raising me the same way, but in another environment. Right. You know what I'm saying? Now I feel you, my father's Chinese and they're very like that on the Chinese side of the family. And it, it gets, it's difficult. They're not, you know Which, my dad. He's yes. not. Is he's it not, is it more yeah. is it more like um, disciplinar disciplinarian than friend or like oh I'm growing up. We're I not think friends. now that older years. Now as I'm old, but yeah. we yeah. still never was and, like and that then, growing then you, up. Then you hang around your American friends and they'd be like, Dad, yeah. guess what happened today? It's so cool. Now Let's I get Tommy Dad Elfinger. mad funny now, like and cool yeah. now. But I know back in the day it wasn't the same way. But he jokes with us and laugh, and we think he's the funniest person in the world. But she like. No, nah, my, father, back my, in father, the day. my father, my father, my father got like that recently though. Right. Like my father, my man, mother too. My father Older stayed. Age. My father stayed for stayed stayed in my house. I just boy, he stayed with me for like a month, two months, and he was cooking, he was laughing, we was drinking together, and I'm just like, oh. and he probably tells everybody else that you're his son. Yeah, like when he goes, and he's, yeah. so, he's proud. so proud of you, and so he's proud proud of yeah, you. for sure. Yeah. But he doesn't tell you. It could it, bro? I'm Never one in you, a right? fucking million. You know, like my nigga being <laughs> from DC. And being full blood Nigerian, like it's two crowds that can turn you down or accept you, and rarely has it even even happened at the same time. You know what I'm saying? I'm one in a million. And then plus, <clears throat> you, y'all can do a poll. Any African, any uh, Jamaican, Chinese, mm-hmm. Japanese, anybody of second generation, tell your parents you want to get in the entertainment business. Right. Oh whose parents God. will say yes, and whose parents will say, <laughs> be an accountant, yeah, 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 be a lawyer, be a doctor. Right. Because they moved to America and be like, doctor, lawyer, that's it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But my dad was dead like, you're not my daughter. You want to be a rapper that's prostitutes, whores, yeah. drug dealers, oh, and murderers. He's Puerto Rican. Wow. He did not like nobody else. Like, 
And I mean, he like my mother. She black. But when you, but, I don't but, when, know. You, but when you, when you, when you, when you got your name, that. when you made a name for yourself, it was like, oh, okay. Oh nah, he was telling everybody like, oh, my daughter is on. And, and you, I'm like, you don't want to. Well, me, I personally, I don't want to play that. You remember when you said this? Nah, nah, I, I wasn't play that. But it's like not. I could, I could. Well, nah, my dad but passed away it. now, but I was already started doing something on TV. I did love and hip hop. So at that proud. time, he, he was, was proud. proud. And I was like, ain't this a bitch? Because mm-hmm. he the fucking disowned me for mad years of my anything? life. Hell yeah, I said something. Yeah. I was scared of my dad, though. I was but I scared said of something. Too. Yeah, I said something mm-hmm. because I felt the way for mad years. Still to this day, I feel the way. You know what I mean? Because you're gonna you dealing with this your whole life. This your, your parent. You know what I mean? So you're going to feel away. But, you know. How does that affect how you treat your daughter now, though? Mm. Because I'm sure oh, you wow. have to show her this so much the, affection. This is the universe talking right now. Because, <laughs> you know, you know, I had a real, like, I had a tough morning. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm sorry, I just put this the way that, that it doesn't get nobody mad or in trouble. I, I, I've I grown apart from my daughter's mother. I, I also think she's an amazing woman, first of all. I just think that we've grown apart and it it's made it really hard, like, because, oh, no, nah, I'm not going to cry. This is not going to happen right here. Hold on real quick. What's up with them Eagles? <laughs> they doing shitty from the last time I checked. They thought they was going to make it to the, to the chip right. again this year, and they lost last week. Right, we back. Okay. Back from our regular, to our regularly scheduled program. The shit that hurts the most, right, I'm so proud of my daughter. I'm so happy for my daughter. I'm so in love with her. I, I love everything that she does. I can't physically be there as much as I would like to right now. Mm-hmm. Right now, I'm in a tricky, weird, weird position. You live, my daughter live in a small city. You know what I'm saying? I can't go there unless I'm moving a certain way and, you know, I got somewhere to record work. I have to continue to work. I got to, like, to, 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 to get complacent where would I'm at, at now, it wouldn't, it'd be an injustice to her. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And her mother for real. But mostly important is it be an injustice to Zala if I slow up now. I don't know what going on. Slim, my my close one of my well my my closest cousin died two days after his child was born in a car accident. Mm. That shit fucked my life. That's when that's when everything started popping up in my life and wigging out on the media and all of that. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't I, I look at that like, okay, shit. You know, God forbid something happened to me. And I hate saying these in interviews because I feel like you're speaking into existence. But it's like, yo, I gotta make sure I don't care. Like, with like the like her mother, like she be like, oh, you're not around enough, and da 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 da. And from the bottom of my heart, I just be like, yo, car, house, comfortable, right? All three checked off. Okay, let me do what I gotta do to make sure that both of y'all good, because. 90% chance we're not gonna end up together. But I'm not gonna let I'm not gonna leave you high and dry. Because you was my friend and we made her out of love. You know what I'm saying? We made her out of love. This wasn't no little whoops joint, like you know what I'm saying? We made her out of love. So all I think about every day when I'm in that studio, man, let me make something special. Let me make something great. Let me make something that's gonna change everybody's life and, and put everybody on a on a strong trajectory. You know what I'm saying? I'm not there yet. Mm-hmm. I came up with a lot of niggas that's there yet, that there right now, but I'm not there yet. And I could be wrong. A lot of women, a lot of mothers can watch it and be like, I think right now, while I'm young, while I'm while my while I'm creative, I'm young, I'm healthy, is go get that bag and put it up for Zyla and her mother. If something happened to me, it's niggas that don't like me. It's niggas, anything can happen in the street, whatever. I'm gonna do what I gotta do for Shardy right now. You know what I'm saying? And there's conflict. There's conflict a little bit at home because of that. Oh, not my That's home. That's a hard home. balance, though. You know, it is. It is. It's a, it's, it's a hard balance because on one point you see the benefit of how important it is to be there for your daughter. But then for you, it's, well, part you know of me being there for her work. is making sure I tell that... Her, my, I, tell, I'm, I tell myself, and it's hard not to be there. Right. But I be like, she's two. She's two. 
if you could go, if you could get, the, if you could get to this place right now before she's three and a half, and she can four, remember. Then I could be like, oh shit, I could just take a PJ real quick and just stay there. Right. And I got a and I got a little condo over there, like so I could just you know what I'm saying with the woo. Like I don't want to argue. I don't want to argue. I don't want to. I don't want to be nasty in the media. I don't mm-hmm. want to blah blah blah. That's why I don't. You know, gallivant with women on on in 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 public and all that other stuff. I don't want to do all of that. Are you affectionate with your daughter when you're around her? Are you? Oh my God, this is this is turning to a therapy session. But I need mm-hmm. it, and I trust you. I um. I swear to God, I probably realized this. Um, probably when Mac died, when she brought the cookie. She, like, I have this deficiency, like where it's like. I'll see my child. I'm crying my eyes. I'm my eyes puffy. I've just calmed down. I walk back in the house and she comes up. And it's like, it's weird. And nobody might not feel me on this. It's like, go to your uncle. Cause I don't even want to this sad you don't energy. To see that. I don't want to I don't want to channel it through you, through picking you up and me crying and holding you. Like you, you. Looking at your eyes make me think about what if I lost you? For some weird reason, that's where my mind went. And it's like I had to walk away from my daughter. Like, And that's when I realized I have a real deficiency with being gentle with a small toddler girl. You know what I'm saying? I don't know how because it's like I, sometimes I, I, I imagine, okay, what if I had a boy, right? I feel like I, I probably just joke with him on some daddy shit. Like, yo, come on, nigga, stop crying, man. Stop crying, man. Come on, what's up? All right, go ahead, cry a little bit. But after you're done crying, come on, come on over to dad. Like, I can, it's a tone. Come back to your father. Come on, cry on my shoulder, man. You good? You good? But you it's good? Different with it because but it, you're a girl. but I, I'm trying to raise a strong woman, and it's like the strongest woman that she knows is her mother. Mm-hmm. Whoa, shit! One of the strongest women I know is her mother. If she's crying for her mother. I'm gonna take her to her mother, because I don't know how to be. I don't. I, I I realize that I don't know how to be gentle and to be like, oh, oh, uh, baby, read me your ABCs and oh, it, it, it always feels weird with me. And, and my sister was telling me this the other day, like, you know, it's because of the way you was raised, bro. Like, yeah. you was raised in a way like you don't know how. You literally it's don't. It's very hard to give what you don't. What it's it, it's a, it's acting. It's acting. If you don't if you don't know it, it's right. literally acting. Mm-hmm. And it's like, it makes sense. But I'm coming to this realization right now. Right. Like like literally, I'm talking about today. I almost didn't come because I was about to be too negative, bro. Because I like I hate argue, arguments that have anything to do with my daughter. Mm-hmm. I hate them so much. And again, I say her mother is doing a great job. She's te- her, my my daughter is fast. She's advanced. She's God, oh, she's just, she's got it, like, she's got it. But I'm not, I know I'm not around him. I, in the past 10 days, I was in Paris, Paris or no, uh, I went from L.A. to D.C., to Atlanta, to Paris. To New York. To New York again, back to L.A., and now back to New York in, like, 11 days. Like, I'm tired. Right. You know what I'm saying? And to land... And like, oh, you know, I might see something on Twitter or something like that, like from somebody that she know, which which means it's like this is how she feeling, whatever. That shit, that shit got me, man. Mm-hmm. Cause like, bro, I'm, I don't stand for that. I don't like none of that absentee father shit. Like, but I can't, I'm not, I can't get a, I can't get a profit jet to, to to go to your city. You know, but it's hard for both of y'all. Right. I'm, for her, she wants you there. Absolutely. For your daughter, and then for you, you have a goal that you're doing to try to make sure you take care of her. Great men. And I'm not saying this for my I'm not saying this for me personally, but like great men in our in our history that have tried to do great things or have done great things have always had multiple women. And I don't think that's because of greed or anything. I think it's because you sign up for something when you deal when you doing when you're dealing with somebody that's trying to do something great. You sign up for something and you know, they I mean, might they might they might really just be like, Okay, I'm dedicated to my I wanna be great at this job, I wanna be great at this speech, I wanna be great at this invention and they obsess over it. Steven Spielberg, Jim Hansen, all these people obsess over their job to the maximum. I tried to, bro, if you knew how many times that I tried to redefine black music in one session, 
Mm-hmm. Nigga, I might take mint condition band and uh, 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 mix it with Metro Boomin and just try to come up with a new sound like for 10 hours and it never come out because it didn't sound right. But this is who you've always been, though. You've always been this person. I've so evolved I feel into like this person. You've evolved into this person, but it wasn't in the past two years. So she knew the person that she was having a child with. But what I will say is... I don't know. I don't know, I don't know if I'm the same exact person. Well, you've evolved, obviously. Yeah. But I think you have gotten... You know, God could have gave you a little boy that's a little more tougher. He gave you a little girl. And that was to make you a little more sensitive. And you speak to women... A it lot. hurts though. But, but like, it actually, you're it not, hurts. you're not feeling for women. You speak to women a lot, but the when she came to give you the cookie, that was God. You know what I mean? Trying to bring you to another place. And I when you push to, it away, I was trying not to let her see me in, in that state, state because. But that's her, okay. she was there to be there for you. But that's soul. okay. She was coming yeah. to be there for you. No, I ate the She's cookie. not gonna remember I that. I ate the cookie. I, I, ate, the cookie. I, ate, the cookie. I ate the cookie. <laughs> but that's okay for your daughter to see you like that. That's okay. your daughter. That's a human yeah, thing. Yeah, for sure, for sure. But you know, and I that's mean, in a, that moment, I'm just like, no, nah, baby, daddy's okay. Everything's okay. Right. Everything's okay. Like, but that's when you explain. Yes, daddy. It was a daddy thunderstorm. Is thunderstorm sad. At this. Daddy is sad. It was thunderstorm outside. It was just a weird. I was just in a weird place, and I was like. Let me just get like I just I gotta get away. They're from saying them. that you have to wrap up, so I I hate yeah, to. They, they yeah, they kicked us. They kicked you out a long time ago. Part yeah. one, part but one. That's you. Yeah, this is part one. <laughs> right. But have I, I changed? You have changed. You um, evolved. evolved. You've grown. <laughs> You've grown into more of a man. You were more of a boy when. Well, I literally had was a boy. Yeah, he's like literally I was. Yeah. And you, you've definitely grown into more of a man and. You might not realize it yet, but fatherhood has a lot to do with that. Oh, whoa. <laughs> Ain't nobody see that. Well, you haven't grown. Fatherhood has an old drink like that. Well, you missed your mouth. <laughs> okay, look at his face. Can we get him a napkin, please? Right, a napkin. Immediately. <laughs> we'll shout out our sponsor, Alex. <laughs> and um, I just want to end it, though, by saying, you know, just as you make time and you said you've been in all these different places in the past 11 days, you know, schedule that time also. I think that helps. Yeah, like, that's what yeah, I was going to say. Sure. Yeah, that's part of the schedule. Sure, but it's, it's, it's also like... Um, that's part of the schedule of, like, I'm not man, working for manage, these want to manage expectations, week. too, sometimes. Right. Like, you know, um, I just don't want, you know, I want the time for her to be... And plus, she's in that age where, like, she's with her mother so much that, like, Two years old, like they, they, they. And at this age, she's a sponge. Yeah. And mm-hmm. she's soaking it all in. Two years old, and she can't really be that long without her mother for real. Right. She can't be. It's been like, it, like you know, I don't want to see her cry. Like I remember, we went for a walk uh, the other day, and she just started being like, um, "I want to go to the park, 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 park." And I was like, "Daddy has a flight. I gotta. Daddy has to get a flight." But she's like, "Park, park, park, park," and you know, I had to pick her up, and she started throwing a tantrum. I'm like. Charlie, when you start Terrible doing, twos. When you start doing tantrums. That's part of the process. That's what two do. But well, also, that's how you know that's your daughter, because you... I, I talk, I talk, like, when you have to tell you, you start acting like this. That's my daughter. You start acting like this. I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready. I was not ready. You know they say you get it back times three. Right. I'm not going to lie. This is one of my favorite episodes, even though Wale looked like he wanted to kill me in the middle of it. When? What part? No. We'll talk about it later. We'll talk about it, yeah. But not even bring it back up. No, I won't. We won't. We could have talked to you for hours, but... <laughs> Listen, Wale, we will continue we to talk. Knew we, we, we knew this was going to happen when we first, because, you know, I, 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 I thought I, you was going to talk about eating pussy and shit I like love that. It. I know, know we did want to hear some yeah. eating maybe, pussy maybe, 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 um, maybe, a, maybe, a, maybe, a, maybe, a, maybe a come later. Right. <laughs> 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 maybe it'll come later. All right, ask me, two, ask me two eating pussy questions. Okay, quick. go ahead, real quick, real quick. What's the first, what's the first move? Get out, get out, get out. Bye. Get out, get out. Get out of here. Get out of here. For real, man. Do you go? inside or you just stay on the outside <laughs> you read her body language everybody's body's wired differently true. Mm-hmm. and as a true technician mechanic that i try to be you gotta read the body <laughs> language some some is involuntary some is voluntary you gotta read for the involuntary the involuntary is what they really like some girls don't like what they really like you know it's some too much for them really it's too like. much what they yeah and mm-hmm. it's like oh my god like you 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 get you you right you you you, you swimming we're gonna speak a metaphor you swimming you're in a certain part and you stay right there, and they, that that part is, hasn't really been tapped into in the specific manner in which that you're swimming. I don't want to squirt. <laughs> Stop. Do you like a squirter? I was just about to ask that. Um, 
trying to figure that out. <laughs> it scared me the first time. Really? It scared me the first Did time. Did you scream? <laughs> Did it get in your dress? No. <laughs> <laughs> Not my hair. <laughs> Somebody sent us a beat called Squirt in My Dreads. <laughs> um, I actually Buddha Buddha might have beats, one. Okay? <laughs> we in Buddha's studio. Okay. Buddha got the beats, so he okay. might have Squirt in My Dreads. Well, okay. um, now, nah, well, you, you know, me personally, like, um, if I like a girl, like like her, like like her, like you know what I'm saying, like I'm a I'm a do I'm a do I'm well, I'm gonna try. You, you know, I'm like 98 percent from the field, but I'm gonna try. <laughs> as, far, as far as as far as, make, as far as trying to find the as far as, far as as far as trying to please him with that, like eating pussy, like yeah, you gotta find it. You gotta find it. Like you gotta find it. It's it's it's, it's it's in there. It's there. Every woman got it, but you gotta That's find it, say. and then you gotta find it, and then know what to do with it. You can't. Some got you gotta come in a certain way, and some you gotta come a certain way. You gotta find it. <laughs> do you like for girls to sit on your face? Depends how much I like them. Can you breathe when they do it though? <laughs> Depends just, on how big they are. That's why you do curls in the gym. Not so a butt. You just lift. It's you got you grab the grab the how thighs. How big the body part? You gotta you got you grab the thighs and lift it up a little bit so they feel in control, and so you know. What about the butt? No, no, you don't look at your butt. No, no. no. <laughs> look at his own face. It's right there, though. That's like a. That's like a. Let, that's like a super uber drunk. We are not talking about this night, like joint. So you uh, have though, but you just. Oh yeah. no. Maybe I have. He's right go there for it's nasty. a possibility. I know. It's not. a possibility that he's. Probably he don't not. want to say no. He don't want nobody to be like, oh, don't lie, like you wasn't so eating you my, eat butt. my ass the other night. So you told me you don't eat ass. I don't think. I don't know. Y'all just gave a lot of girls a a a, a joke to lie. <laughs> Joe said, I don't even know. You just yeah. did that. Nah, they're they gonna lie. They're gonna lie. Like they're they gonna lie. Wait, do you like when they pull your dress, dog? Like, yeah. 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 Show me, show, show <laughs> okay. me, you know, show me that you know something about something. And you like, Pull don't mess, don't me, you're mess not scared. Let me know you're not, that, you speak it to me the, in another way. You let me know I, I ain't scared Body of you, language. nigga. I ain't scared <laughs> of you, nigga. Like, yeah, nigga, what's up? <laughs> yeah. But then you're going to still submit at some point. So I said, we're going to do it. Shit. Not, by, not, not, by, not, by, not by verbal request. It's just by the game, though. You know what I mean? But do you talk while you're fucking? You sometimes, know he does. Sometimes. Yeah. sometimes. What's your dirtiest line? I don't got none. Do you what's call up? him slut? What's up? What's, What's up? up? That's what you say? What's up? What's up? Pull my dreads. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Come in my I, hair. I don't even, I don't even say Squirt no. in my dreads. Squirt in my hair. Do no. you say stuff like, um, let me come all over your face? Woo! Issa Rae. <laughs> insecurity. Oh, no, insecure. Tell me insecure. insecure. Sorry, insecure. Fuck. So, <laughs> she was, she was mad that he came, came on her face. The guy came in her this face. This is the last episode, right? No, no, no this, this last, last season. season. Oh, yeah. It was in the carnival, John, and all that. I wasn't saying it was her. Didn't last season, too? Like, I don't want no problems. The first season that happened too, or the second oh, it was, season, whatever it was, that's when it happened. He came yeah, in her yeah, face. He was mad, like in her eyes on me. Yeah, 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 exactly. Do you like coming in a girl's face? No, I don't, I don't know. If, a, if, if, if you hitting a girl no, and she no, like, no, no, I want you to come no. on my face. No, I think you. I think we. I think we talking Mid-stroke. about. We talking about like like sport sport fucking and. <laughs> Like relationship, sex. You don't think you can mix the both? That should be. That's. That's. An, I gotta see a shrink about What's that. What's the difference between relationship, sex, and sp- man? Nah, you know, I, relationship, like, sex really is, like is love making. I, I, I don't want like. You don't want to come I'm, on I'm, face. I, I want to learn how to because I feel like that's how you stay married. Yeah. But I, I don't know how to that like. If I really so like the joke, married. like. Like, yo, Merit. Slim, I'm not, I can't, I don't know how to. Don't try to get married. I don't, I don't know how to you do. You can't be dirty with the girl you love? It's weird. No, it's you gotta no, be dirty with weird? the girl you I love. I know. That's why you gotta start I mean, off. Let me tell you something. That's why you gotta start off on that motherfucking page. Homeboy, that's listen the one to you your OG, You gotta start homeboy. off right there. <laughs> Look, homeboy, if you start listen off, to your OG. Let me tell if you, you start, If you start <laughs> off on that page with the nasty sex and shit like that, and then y'all start really liking each other, then you already started it. But if you like dating and, and courting Gradually. and doing all that, and you get to that, you gonna be fucking a missionary and... Look so that it. bitch got to throw up That's on your boring. dick the first night. <laughs> don't throw up on my dick. Never. <laughs> in a dream. <laughs> don't even dream no, you do that shit. No, I know what you mean. That's Has anybody ever it's, it's a hyperbole or metaphor yeah, for nasty sex. Yeah. Has a woman yeah. asked you to do something so crazy, you were like, I ain't doing that. I think my eyes say a lot when, before we get started. Like, I think my eyes say a couple things like... Bitch, you better not never. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> this episode that turned totally here. different. And then the soundtrack. The soundtrack. What's the you know? soundtrack? Wait. Can I give everybody a motherfucking uh, PSA or what to do? Yes. You Go. gotta be quick with it, right? Come back from the club, right? 
Jump in the shower. You go first. Get her phone. Well, if you ah. don't, get her phone. <laughs> Jump in the shower, right? right? Handy business. Then she go in the shower. You set up the acoustics or the sound in the room. Now, I don't know if you were six minute, eight minute, twelve minute, four minute, three minute kind of guy. Some of them look like ones. You make shit. I've been one. I've been one one time. <laughs> no. Man, unexpected sex. Get, get will make you come fast and shit. What? Comes. No, no. Unexpected <laughs> sex cart. make you come f- like shit. Like it's like, yo, what? Where did this come from? Come. <laughs> <laughs> they all laughing because they agree. <laughs> all of the guys <laughs> in the room <laughs> has had that well, you happen know, to them well, You know, you about to smash. It's like, all right, I'm gonna, you know, what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> we will do. We will do. We will do. We will do. When she in the camera, when she in the, uh, in the shower, you put together your little playlist of however you want the sex to be. Visualize it. You wanted to be gangster sex. Yeah. You wanted to be some go-go. smooth shit. It's pretty cold. I don't know if I can fuck the go go. Oh, back, <laughs> oh, back y'all, back y'all bands. Um, interpretation of um, <laughs> boys to Atlantis. Oh, that's that would be poppy. a vibe. I wish they put that shit. Man, somebody got to put that, that shit. They got to put it on Spotify. It was, it was, it, it's so good. I grew up on that jam. Like that's me going to school in eighth and ninth grade, tenth grade, listening to that jam. They used to open with that song sometimes. Boys to Atlantis, the go go version. It just sounds like a a grainy um, big band version of the song, but like, or even a regular voice to a Linus by the Ozzy Brothers. That's a good, that's a good starter. But get a playlist together. How I you like a playlist. How I'm vision. You know, like I'm the only person that's or, not Or you gotta tell yourself, I gotta make it to this song. I gotta make it to this song. That's why I do a shuffle. No. Nah. <laughs> well, yeah, 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 yeah. You, you gotta know something. what song you gonna make it to. The song I'm a bust to. I All right, look at that while they go because they're oh, yeah, yeah. like they about to. Yeah, it's about they to be about over. To, they about to come like, snatch our mic. His mic died. It's ever happened. Yeah. Say lip service. But we appreciate you, Wale, so much. We're gonna have a part two for Hold sure. Yo, Wale. <laughs> he don't like to hold his no, mic. No, your mic just I love it, your mic just came and it's that is lip mic. She got the lip mic. Baby, <laughs> baby, can we do another round? Yeah, 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 I got you. How many minutes? Uh, 20 minutes? Uh, no, 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 I got you, I got you, I got you. Uh, no, 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 just kiss it a little bit, just kiss it a little bit. Uh, Angela, kiss it, kiss right, I'm, about to, I'm about to put a condom on real quick. Yeah. <laughs> That's how it works. Did this happen to you today? That's the visual representation. Speaks from experience, Wale. No, this is my imagination. (laughs) Yeah, I can't not with y'all. Make sure y'all download that EP. Wale, part two, next time you come back. Free lunch, free lunch. Three days, three hours. All that, free lunch. Three days, three hours, and for him, three minutes. We didn't get no lunch today. We're still hungry, Wale. Shit, I'm still hungry. Three minutes. Where the fuck is our free lunch? Three minutes. Three minutes. Three minutes, no hours. <laughs> Three minutes, no hours. Three times. <laughs> Yo. Yeah. Uh, well, I like.